Uh, hello, everybody. Welcome, welcome to some more Pokemon BGC Master Ball Masochism. Uh, we have a new teammate today. I know everyone's going to be really sad about this, but I did the calculations and we got a Don fan who like perfectly takes over the Trudeau Wudo's space. I know, I know. Trudeau Wudo is like the GOAT. Let's be honest, who doesn't love Trudeau Wudo? He has carried us through so many Urshifu fights. <laughs> He's carried us so hard through through so many Urshifu fights. Like Terra Grass on him was amazing. And though the the base power of the wood hammer, plus like head smash and stuff, was really good. Uh, uh thank you, Ed, for the tier one sub for 24 months. God dang, that is too whole years true to wudo for president i'd vote for him he's got my vote for sure you know if, despite being you know a pseudo wudo he is the most true person i've ever met you know he always tells the truth he's like honest abe look at him look at him look at that face he don't lie he don't lie he's green because he's truly the most tree ah <laughs> uh, hello you oh thank you for the bald redeem thank you thank you look at that Man, I don't need hair. I don't need hair to win at Pokemon. You lurky. Have a good lurky. Yeah. Hello, hello. Hope you're having a great Friday, too. Mm -hmm. He's ki he kind of is Canadian president already. I mean, you're not wrong. But sadly, Don fan here. Also, my game is muted for some reason. Let me fix that. I'm wondering why there's no sound. It's like, ooh, had it muted the whole time? Look at this guy. Look at this shiny boy. He's no great tusk, okay? He's no great tusk. He's no iron tusk. I don't remember what their names are, but he does have, he's banded. I did band him. He's got the, the choice band. I did make him adamant. He's got sturdy and he's got the high horsepower. He's Terra Grass for his seed bomb against Urshifu. He's got Gunshot, Ice Spinner for just like, you know, really good uh, coverage moves. But ground type just hits so much better than rock type. Like immunity to electric opens up so many possibilities because we were always having troubles with like iron hands and even like great neck. We've had so many issues with this man just takes care of them, like pops in high horsepowers, leaves, doesn't ask any questions. They're dead. And also I specifically EV'd him to have like 92 speed EVs. So he always outspeeds minus speed armor rage. So we're not getting hit with that expanding force bull crap anymore because he could just one shot armor rage with high horsepower. It's beautiful. He's a beautiful soul. I will miss Trudeau Wudo super dearly. I love Trudeau Wudo. He is the goat, but Don fan, he just hits, he just hits. He just slaps with his great old, you know, elephant nose. His trunk, that's what they're called. He just slaps the competition away. Look at him. He's even green. Just like Trudeau Wudo. Oh, whatever. It's fine. That's the team. That's the team we're going for. And hopefully this will be a lot better than last week. Where we had such a great start and then completely crumpled in the middle. <laughs> I lost so many, so many fights in a row. It was so sad. I think we only won like four times. Oh, Empoleon's on this. Okay, okay. 
Oh, I also got to get my counter. Let's go. 51 wins. Can we hit 60 today? Probably not. <laughs> Probably not. All right. New season hasn't started yet, I'm pretty sure. No, I lied, actually. It, uh, <laughs> I completely lied. A new season has started. Uh, when did that happen? When did the new season happen? Oh, 31. Okay. We were just off of doing the new season. Okay. Why is the season only one? I'm in Pokeball again? <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. We're back in Pokemon. Pokeball. I'm screwed, guys. I'm so screwed. I'm never getting back to Ultra Ball. I cannot beat the Ultra Ball allegations. No item on Don Fan? Oh, crap. He doesn't have the... I swear to God, I put the Choice Band on him. Oh, you know what happened? I put the choice band on him and I tweeted yesterday that I got a glitch where my my game was frozen on that end of raid screen because I was getting him grass terror shards. And I guess I forgot to put the item back on him after I had to restart the game because it wasn't saved anymore. Well, um, that's unfortunate. Uh, doesn't look like Don Fan would have been the most useful here anyways, so I'm not too mad. I mean, he, he walls King Gambit and kind of Scovellion. And kind of muck, actually. Now that I'm looking at his team, I'm really sad. Um, I think we're going to lead Malamar Ambipom here. And then we're going to have Golduck and Politoed in the back. Does Ambipom... Ambipom doesn't run Brick Break, does he? I forget. No, he runs Upper Hand. Should I replace Upper Hand with Brick Break? I'm starting to think I should. Honestly, upper hand, I've not been able to use like at all. Like at all. It's so sad. Yeah, I would have loved to use Don Fan here. God dang it. Why did I forget the item? Man. Uh, at least I know I, know I got the, uh, the EVs and IVs all sorted out. For sure, for sure, for sure. I'm, I hope. <laughs> I hope. Look at this. Dawn fan would have swept here. All right. Well, we just superpower, right? Do we Terra? Terra Steel actually doesn't seem too bad. Terra Steel superpower. Because then Muck. If Muck goes for a poison move, we are immune to that. And also, if he goes for a dark move, we won't be weak to it. I think we're just going to fake out Muck, actually. We should just fake out Muck. What am I even saying? Yeah, just fake out the Muck. Don't even have to worry about it. Sucker Punch. Failed. He tried to Sucker Punch and palm you fool. Get killed. Get killed. Let's go, Malamar. Malamar, the absolute goat. Power of Alchemy. What the hell is that? What is Defiant again? Is Defiant, when you get a kill, you get an attack boost? I think that's how that works, right? No, it's like when you get a stat drop, you get an attack boost, right? Yeah, because like that's for like in Tim and stuff like that. You get like two attack boosts. This guy don't know. This guy don't know. All right, I'm going to Psycho Cut. Do I double up on Amoongus? Do I even double up on Amoongus? Or I could knock off. Or I could just superpower again, Muck, and I could just go for the triple axle. Terra Ice triple axle on the Amoongus. I think that's the play. If I could just get this guy out, it'll be two, it'll be two V four, and we'll be in a really good position. So I think I'm gonna go for that. Hopefully he doesn't like Terra Rock or something here. Yeah, I want to Terra early. When I have the advantage like this, I want to tear it early to like keep a huge advantage. Like maybe this might bite me in the ass, but I think as long as all three of these hit, he just dies, right? It's not even a rocky helmet, Amoongus. Get out of here. Get out of here. Easy. Man, I missed Pokeball. <laughs> or we could just get wins. We just pick up kills for free. What a great game. 
Okay, it didn't kill. Wasn't expecting that to kill. It actually did more than I thought, because isn't usually Lowland Muck super tanky? Minimize. This guy is going for the strats. This man's going for evasion strats. Zero respect. Zero respect. How dare. Like, honestly, I feel disrespected so much. One for the minimize. Psh, 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 psh. Um, I, um, did he give up? No, oh, mimic you. Okay, ghost fairy. I mean, I guess I can knock off here and I can triple axle to break his thing. I think that's the best play. I'll triple axle break his thing on the first hit. Wasn't even targeting Muck. I'm fine. I'm fine. Triple Axel is really good against Mimikyu. It'll break his protect thing on the first hit and then the rest will just do damage. He hasn't Terrid yet, which is very interesting. Oh, that Mimikyu is just dead, actually. Oop. Oop. <laughs> Oopsie daisy. It's just dead. I apologize. <laughs> Never apologized. That guy is dead as heck. All right. All right, all right, all right. You know, uh, this might be over, over, overconfident of me, but we, I think we won this. I think we've won. We've taken literally zero damage so far. I think we win this. Even with evasion mechanics, I think we'll just win. Like, look, look at this. Easy game. Hit again. Nice. Easy win. Pokeball tier is my kind of tier. Let's go. We also got really lucky with his Pokemon choices. We just like swept. That King Gambit with the Malamar. Ah. Oh, thank you, Ed, for the winny bitty. I deserve it. I deserve it. That was a no damage win. That was like playing Street Fighter and just like absolutely not getting hit. We're gaming. Put item on elephant. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. I can't believe I forgot. I like I made sure to like get his IVs and EVs back after the game reset. I just completely forgot to add an item to him. So sad. So sad. Elefante give you the best item in the game. Uh, somewhere. Um, sort by name because I can't find any item in this game without sorting by name. Give him that choice ban. You know, this is going back to like SQ days, you know, when we had banded SQ who did zero damage. <laughs> I'm so happy. I'm so happy the first DLC gave Ambipom triple axel. That was the only way because SQ, literally banded SQ does less damage than triple axel Ambipom without even tearing. It's kind of crazy. It's kind of sad actually. Because SQ is really decent in like normals when he, when Hale is up. He's actually really good. Because he gets his ice head back in normals every time Hale is up. So he's he's really good because you could just put him against a physical attacker and you're fine. But in doubles, it's like, what are you going to do? What are you going to do? Oh, this is a Dawn fan for sure. I think we Dawn pan, Dawn fan and B. Is that the play? Dawn fan here is just so good. Hmm. The only issue here is if he leads like Rillaboom plus Fluttermane, that's really bad for me. I think I bring Masquerade here, funnily enough, for the Intim. And Malamar for the Steel type. Do I lead Malamar instead of Donphan? Malamar is good against ooh, two guys, really. Three guys, actually. Two guys, three guys, three guys. That fan's good against four. Ambipom is, you know, I think we're just going to lead like this. I know Don fan can Oko Fluttermane from full HP with like a high horsepower. Or Gunk Shot? I think Gunk Shot, Gunk Shot's actually neutral against Fluttermane. Because Fluttermane, I think Ghost resists Poison, maybe? It was something weird like that. Okay, this is actually kind of what I was hoping for. 
This isn't bad. If we can outspeed the Flutter main here. If he doesn't get a speed boost here. If he's special attack, we outspeed, we kill. No. Okay, so we don't outspeed Flutter main. I think I'm just going to high horsepower there. And I'm just going to non-Terra triple axle Melanelletto. And hope I don't die. Oh, I forgot about fake out. I forgot Iron Palms gets fake out. It's a little unfortunate, but eh. Oh, the speed down is really bad. Uh. Oh, does that not kill? Non-boost? Is that like a little bit defensive? Oh my god, the speed down there is so bad for me. Um, do we swap here? I think we swap to Masquerade here. And we're just going to do it again. I think Ambipom dies here. But I am expecting a Drain Punch, which I'm not too worried about. He might target the, uh... Oh no, so he's just using Dazzling Gleam, which we do tank with Ambipom, barely. So we can at least get rid of that. That's really good. If he Drain Palms, um, Masquerade here, it's really good for me. But I think he also might just Drain Palm, Ambipom to... Yeah, okay. That's fine. Honestly, that's fine. That's fine, that's fine, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. <laughs> it's not great. We're not in a great position here because this team is just better than us. So us losing out at the beginning is not great, but this Cinderace is terrifying. Yeah, we can't even tear a grass to like tank anything here. Uh, I think we just Hydro Pump. Do we Tailwind? I think we Tailwind. Tailwind high horsepower here is pretty good. Because if, uh, I'm assuming Don Fan dies before doing any damage. But then if Malamar comes out under Tailwind, he's really good. Yeah, that's unfortunate. Flying type! Oh my god, that's unfortunate. That's really unfortunate. And he targets Masquerain! Oh, that's so bad for me! Yeah, we lose. We lost this. I don't think there's any way we win. I cannot believe he, he even chose who I was going to target. He even knew which one. Cinderace, you mean the pseudo pal? You're so right. That's actually just uh, whatever that pal's name is. Leaf, Leaf guy. Yeah, I don't think we win here like at all. Yeah, there's like nothing we can do here. We just lose. We just lose. We we sadly we lose like super bad. <laughs> we lose like super bad. Yeah, there's no way. There's no way we tank anything here. Yeah. Yeah, nice to tech nerd. That's fine. I mean, there's just like nothing. There's like nothing. There's literally nothing. He ha I have to like uh, crit Oko here. That crit wouldn't even kill. Yeah, no, that's unfortunate that he Terra flying there. That that one move absolutely killed my momentum. Was there anything I could have done there instead? I could have high horsepowered the Terra or the the Iron Palms, Iron Hands, whatever his name is, and that would have been really good because then it would have been a two v two. But it, I would have still been the weakened one. Yeah, not bringing Masquerade. I should have brought Polytoed. I was just, I was really expecting Rillaboom, which he didn't bring at all. Against my team of mostly guys weak to Rillaboom, he didn't bring Rillaboom, which is really weird. Like, I have three Pokemon that just died to Rillaboom, and I have three Pokemon who are strong against Cinderace, and he brought Cinderace. I, I mean, he could have brought Rillaboom in the back, I guess. It's just weird. I mean, he outplayed me for sure there. Okay. Um, I think we just do our normal leads here. If he leads 
uh, Chien Pao. We just fake out superpower. That thing's dead. If he leads Incineroar, Malamar gets the attack boost, and we can just fake out with Ambipom and then switch. Dawn Fan here is really good. Kills Incineroar. Kills um, Urshifu. Kills Duraludon. Elipur means we don't need our own water, so maybe we bring in Masquerain against against two. Urshifu, he always crits. Let's bring in Golduck. Yeah, this is not going to be good for me. I did increase the wins, right? Yeah, no, it was 51 before. Because so, I think I forgot to last time, but then I ended up doing it. Okay, so this is terrifying. Lead Archaladun. Archaladun. Okay, we're going to fake out him for sure. Because he's going to do that move where he does the... He gets the special attack. And we're just gonna superpower. I'm not, I mean, Hurricane on this Pelipper probably Oko's Ambipom, but that's fine. I'm more worried about this Archaladoon getting his heckin' special attack. Oh, not stamina. I forgot to get stamina. Oh, not Tailwind. Oh no, this is really bad. Okay, this is incredibly bad. Wow. Ugh, that's a big ol' yikes right there. Okay, if I... Oh no! If I triple axle him, he's gonna get all of that back, too. Um, yeah, this is really bad, guys. This is really, really, really bad. This is really, really... I think I lose to this. Okay, we tank that. We're salt best. We're confused. Of course, we get confused whenever I use Hurricane. They never get confused. Yeah, Electro Shot. That's what I was afraid of. Wait. Doesn't he get to attack immediately in the rain? Yeah, okay. They decide to just wait for a little bit. Oh, we tanked that! We tanked that! Oh my god. Rocky Helmet Pelipper? That's a joke. That's a joke right there. I was not expecting Rocky Helmet Pelipper. Holy crap. All right, let's see if Malamar can hit through his confusion. If I don't, I'm calling hacks on this game. Yeah, that's what I thought, game. And it didn't kill. It didn't kill because it got the defense boost. Oh my god, I should have faked up the Pelipper. Apparently, I should have really faked up the Pelipper. All right, well, we're in a really bad position here. Like, an incredibly bad position here. With Tailwind still up, we're not going to outspeed with, like, anything. I mean, Golduck might outspeed in the rain, actually. So that might be decent. Might be able to kill him. I really wish Golduck got Scald. Doesn't make any sense he doesn't. I mean, yeah, all my Pokemon die here. I think, doesn't Ambipom still outspeed our Chaladoon under Tailwind, or was I... No, he doesn't. Of course not. Of course not. Because for some reason, that big hunkin' steel thing outspeeds me under Tailwind, despite Ambipom being, like, really fast. Okay, this is really bad. This is really bad. Okay. Uh, the only way we win this is if Golduck... Can just be like super goaded here and outspeed Archiladon. The problem here is I want a high horsepower. I think I got a Terra Grass Seed Bomb here and hope he doesn't Hurricane Dawn Fan. No, I don't even need the Terra Grass. What am I even saying? I think just Seed Bomb will kill Eliper. And I'm just gonna Arch Beam Archiladon. I have to hope he outspeeds. Okay, that's good. That's good for us. Protect is good for us. Yes! That's so good for us. That's so good. The fact that we outsped under Tailwind. Okay. 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 We need something here. We need something really good. We need like an Earth Shifu right here. Tailwind petered out. Oh, that's so good. 
So we, we kill that guy, guaranteed, next turn. If we can get an Earth Shifu and he does the Aqua Palm Strike on, okay, Amoongus? Eh, how do I feel about Amoongus here? Really bad, actually. Because I can't swap, right? Yeah, because I can't swap, because Choice Ban. Yeah, I mean, Ice Beam is my best bet. It's not a great bet, though, is the thing. Yeah, I need a freeze here. A freeze would be really good. Ooh, Terra Water. Ooh, actually, Terra Water is not bad for me. Seed Bomb will kill now, maybe. Rage Powder's fine. I mean, he's obviously going to get the Tailwind again, which is really bad. But we also take no damage this turn, which is really good. We get a freeze? Never lucky. Never lucky. Tailwind's fine. Rain will end this turn, I think, so we will no longer be faster, unfortunately. That's pretty good. He Rage Powders again. I think I protect this turn. I think I protect on Golduck. Yeah, Rain Stop. That's really unfortunate. I think he's going to target Golduck. He's going to Rage Powder and then Hurricane Golduck. I think that's the play. I'm going to protect. Okay, we have a small chance of winning here. We, if he has Urshifu in the back... We have a small chance of winning. He withdrew a Moongus? For Urshifu? That was not what I was expecting at all, actually. That's insane. That's an insane thing to do. Pelipper miss? Oh, protected. Okay, I did call that. He might swap uh, Pelipper this turn. That's so good. That's so good. All right. We definitely Terra Grass here. Tank this. I think we're going to Ice Beam the Pelipper. If he swaps into Amoongus here, the Ice Beam won't do any damage, but that's fine. We'll be in such a good position. Urshifu might just kill me this turn. Might kill Golduck this turn, which would be very unfortunate. If he kills Golduck this turn with Urshifu and then swaps Pelipper for Moongus, we're in a really bad position. Because then he gets Rain back and Hurricane and we're Terra Grass Dawn fan and we just die. But if he doesn't do exactly that, which would be a really big momentum killer if he doesn't think about it. We might actually, we might actually pull this off if he like surging strikes Dawn fan here. And like misses a hurricane on Pelipper. I think if he does that, we just win, right? We just win. Yes! Okay, okay, okay. It's going good. It's going good. Oh my god, wait, it, this might be it. Wait, oh, are we going to pull back victory from the, pull, the clutches of defeat? That's not how that saying goes. Okay, he hits the hurricane. Very unfortunate. Doesn't kill. Very good. This kills, for sure. Yeah. Yep, 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 yep. Okay. I think my gold like dies here, but that's completely fine. Yeah. And then we kill with Seed Bomb. And then we kill Terra Grass or Terra Water Amoongus. I was not expecting the Terra Water Amoongus to actually be so good for me. Oh my god, we're gaming. We are absolutely gaming. Man, he had one way to win that. He had one way to just absolutely win that. But he can't see the lines like I can. He can't see the truth. He can't see through the veil of Pokemon. Alright, he's still faster than me this turn. So if he gets like a Spore off, it'll be, I'll be annoyed. But he shouldn't have anything to hurt me. He should have literally zero moves to hurt me. I mean, he could spore me, whatever. I'm asleep for like a turn and then I kill him with Seed Bomb. He heals himself to max. I think I Oko with Paragrass Seed Bomb. Because I'm pretty sure I did like a lot of... Oh, I outspeed under Tailwind? Goodbye. Let's go! Oh my god. That one, I was 100% not expecting to win. 
I thank you for the bitty head. Oh my god. See, this time I actually did deserve it. That one was so close. That was like a real team he was playing. And we won. Every time I win against a real team, I'm like so confused and happy. Like winning against a jank team is also really fun because we're also a jank team. But winning like against a competitive team just feels so good. Continue, of course. I gotta get to that great ball ring. All right, I'm gonna stop being bold. I prefer hair. Okay, now that is certainly something. What? 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 What is it though? But what is it though? I'm gonna go into Don Fan Malamar lead, maybe. No, Don Fan Amba Palm lead. Don Fan for the Reggie Lucky. No, the Malamar Amba Palm. Don Fan in the back for the Volt Switch Reggie Lucky. Because he's gonna Volt Switch. No, wait. But then I gotta leave Holly Toad or something. Wait. No, because I can't leave Polly Toad because then he's got Torkoal. So I gotta run these three in the back. <laughs> these two in the back. Urshifu we could deal with, we could fake out, and then we could just uh, Psychic Blast it or whatever. That'll be fine. No, because don't a lot of Urshifu run clear amulets? I mean, if it's not a choice, it's a clear amulet. <laughs> I don't know. That's what's so fun about this. Like, you don't know what they're going to play. Yeah, the Torkoal in the back. He's going to Solar Beam that thing for sure. For sure, he's going to Solar Beam that Hisuian thing. Do I just triple axle that? I think I just triple axle that. I think we outspeed for sure. We kill with triple axle. We go into Politoed. Torkoal can't do nothing. There's no way triple axle doesn't kill here, right? We well, always lead your Politoed in the back. I think Torkoal is the one uh, setup uh, weather user that Politoed can't outslow. Uh, and my Politoed isn't the slowest Politoed you can get because it's not like competitive. It was just caught, so I can't get zero IVs on it. Yeah, Eruption should do no damage here. Yeah, that's fine. I mean, it did a lot of damage to Amber Palm, but yeah, that's fine. Ain't too worried. Ain't too worried. Okay, Cresselia. Cresselia scares me. But not too much. I'm just gonna muddy water. If we're gonna bring the uh, accuracy down to that Cresselia, I'd be not. I'd, it'd be nice. He might just swap here, thinking I'm gonna like Hydro Pump Torkoal spot. Like, and, and he's probably just gonna Trick Room. He just gives up. We're gamers. He just he saw he saw my he saw my true potential, and he's like, I can't handle this. I can't handle this. Oh my god, we're on such a good win streak today. Another witty bitty. Thank you, Ed. You're gonna run out of bitty soon. We're on a win streak. Oh my god. Have we we've lost one out of four games today? That's crazy. This has never happened to me before. I swear to god, this never happens. <laughs> oh no. I'm too hyped. I'm about to get like right when I hit great ball rank. If I win this next game, I hit great ball rank and I'm just gonna crash down. I'm gonna crash down into reality against like a really good team. It's gonna be so sad. So I have a thousand biddies left. Can't win that much. Ah, that's what you think. That's what you think. I'm a professional. I'm gonna hit a thousand wins before I hit a master ball rig for sure. Oh, it's gonna be so sad. Man. I just want to hit Master Ball rank. Our, our highest chance was when we hit that Ultra Ball rank, but I just didn't push enough because I wanted to stream other games. Is that a Rotom Wash? I didn't even know Rotom was in this game. All right. I mean, Don Fan lead is pretty dang good here, actually. Amber Palm, Malamar. I mean, Golduck's really good. Golduck's really good. Golduck's actually really good here. Masquerade does literally nothing. I think he's got one physical attacker. I mean, actually, Dragapult might be a physical attacker. 
And we don't outspeed, actually. Ooh. Does the Amber Palm die to a single Dragon Dart? A banded Dragon Dart? I actually didn't do those calcs. Uh, we'll have to think about that. We might have to double into Dragapult if he's leading. But I think Golduck is the best play here for me. I, maybe not Malamar. What does Malamar do here? Like knockoffs a bunch of guys? That's not bad, actually. Maybe we don't lead Ambipom here. Maybe Ambipom in the back so we can just knock off kill Dragapult because Malamar 100% tanks a Dragon Dart. And so does Dawn Fan. Ambipom doesn't. So I think this is the play. You're gonna sleep before you reach it? I mean, not if I just win a million matches right here. This one, this one counts for a million matches. We we'll just catch all the Pokemon after this. <laughs> he just got a vending machine. Love that. He got reincarnated into the Pokemon world as a vending machine. So sad. Okay, 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 okay. See? Predictions, people. Predictions. Very important. So we're going to just ice. No, we're going to high horsepower this guy, obviously. And then we're going to knock off Dragapult. I think knock off might Oko it. Not 100% sure, but I think it might Oko it. And I know high horsepower might not Oko Garganical, actually. Instead, do I ice spinner? Do I ice spinner knock off? I think an ice spinner knock off, but that doesn't seem right. Dragapult's such an issue. Dragapult's a huge issue. Maybe I should double into it. No, 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 no. I'm going to believe in Dragapult's like zero defense. Well, that's unfortunate. I should have not believed. Oh, oh, that's fortunate. That's fine. Okay, Terragos is fine, actually. Good thing I was thinking of doing superpower into Garganical. Good thing I didn't. That's actually really good for me. Will O Wisp is terrible. Why would you do that? That's just rude. Don't think I'll take that. I'll take that Will O Wisp over uh, Dragon Dart. Yeah, oh, they does just kill. So huge, so huge, so huge, so huge. King's Rock. Okay, hard, hard, this is gonna do, yeah. No damage. That's fine. Salt Cure. That's fine. We tank that. And then we could hit him with a, with a knockoff next turn and kill him, maybe. He doesn't seem... I thought Garganical was, like, really defensive. But if that was what a burned high horsepower did, that wasn't even, new, like, super effective. That's fine. Malmar's getting cured. You guys ever eat cured meat? It's pretty good. I think because it's just beef jerky, right? I mean, beef jerky is just cured meat, right? Or is that different? It's like dried meat. What is cured? I think isn't cured just like dried with salt? Actually, I think I yeah, I don't think I've ever had cured meat. I think it is just dry, like it, you just preserve it in salt and that and that makes it like become cured or something. I'm not sure I've ever had that. I was just thinking of beef jerky for some reason. Here it is, dried inside. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, and it gets like a hard crust on it, right? I kind of want to try it. I feel like I'd really like it. Okay, well, this is fine. We're just going to knock off again. Snark off the Garganical this time. Maybe we should have doubled up into the Garganical. I think that would have been smarter. I should have done that. Because I'm not sure if a knockoff will kill. But Malmar is goaded, so maybe, maybe, maybe. Okay, good thing I didn't double up in it. I'm a genius, guys. You just you just don't understand. I'm a genius. I'm a genius. I'm so smart. He's gonna set up reflect. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whatever. I get my chip damaged. Incredibly good damage considering he's burned. Red card? That's fine, actually. Give me my Golduck. Give me a special attacker here. Well, that's just I need to switch that move with Brick Break. I need to do that. Oh, he just Spirit Breaks, actually. Do we tank that? We don't. Oh, we don't. Oh, lordy, we don't. Oh, lordy, we don't tank at all. All right. That's not great. What do we do here? I mean, Golduck. Hydro Pump? 
Bulldog Hydra Pump might just kill Garganical. Even though it's not super effective. Garganical, I don't think is especially defensive. I could fake out Grim Snarl here, which I think I'll do. I think I'm just gonna Hydro Garganical. Grim Snarl is just like a weird man. What do you think about that? Grim Snarl is just like a weird troll man. He's like a guy who just dressed up in cosplay for Halloween and just like couldn't tell everybody he wasn't a Pokemon <laughs> afterwards. Poor Grim Snarl. He didn't deserve this. All right, Hydro Pump Oko, come on. God. Okay, he's way more especially defensive than I thought. Salt Cure is fine. I think he's just going to protect again this turn. So I might just swap out Golduck. Do I risk it? I think I risk it. I think he's just going to protect again, right? This is a very stally man. And that really hurts Golduck. So we're just going to double hit Grim Snarl and swap into Dawn Fan. Because he just protects here. I've seen that damage on Golduck. Ain't no way he doesn't protect here. I refuse to believe it. I refuse to believe it. He is thinking about it, though. Did I double hit or triple axle? I think I double hit, which I think is fine. I think that'll kill anyways. Yep. Called it. Come on, double hit kills here. He- Oh! Oh, let's go! Let's go the T-Wave into the Dawn Fan. He could double not get T-Wave there. The read? Oh, yeah, obviously I knew he was going to use Prankster. Obviously, I'm, I'm just such a pro. I totally remembered he had Prankster. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Incredible read by me. I completely forgot. I just, I completely forgot. I didn't even know they ran T-Wave. I just know they're like double screen spirit break and I thought they had like knockoff or something. T-Wave makes sense. Where he's running a burn and a T-Wave person on the same team. Ooh. Well, ain't that nice for me. All right, do I Terra here? No, I leave Golduck, obviously. I'm just gonna triple axle him, try to kill him, and let's just Terra. Yeah, let's just hit him with the ice power. Oh wow, that guy is defensive. Holy. That Garganical is tanky. We live that. We don't live that on Donphan. Oh, we lose. Oh, we lost. Oops. 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 We lost. Oops. A Daisy. Oops. Oops, we lost. Oops, oops, oops. Recover! Oh, that's really bad. Oops, a daisy. He lost to make it rain crit. I don't even know if that crit mattered on Amber Palm. I was really expecting Dawn Fan to at least live one, but I guess it's that has to be spec, right? That 100% has to be spec to do that much damage. Is a minus one spec? Golduck doesn't live that, right? Does Golduck love a minus one spec Goldango? Or minus two? Make it rain at this HP? I very much doubt it. But if we don't kill the Garganical here, he just rock salts us and we die anyways. So we kind of have to go for it. Man. Well, I was going to Terra Ice that turn. Maybe I should have done that. If I had Terra Ice, I would have won because that would have killed Garganical. Dang it. That was a misplay on my part. I just didn't think he would tank it that well. Yeah, that's my fault. I really should have Terra Ice there. I think that would have killed. Golly, that did no damage. Yeah, we lost. Even if we tank the Make It Rain this turn, which we don't, because why would we? <laughs> yeah, that was unfortunate. That was really, that was a misplay on me. I think I could have won that for sure. I could have, I could have won that. That was so winnable. Terra Ice on the Amba Palm, you fool. Well, no, because then I couldn't Terra Ground to kill that guy. So I don't think a Hydra Pump would have killed. Right? Mm. 
It's sad that, oh man, if my Dawn fan had the sturdy, but he lost the damage from the burn, so he lost his sturdy. Uh, I'm surprised. I mean, I, I thought Dawn fan would tank the make it rain. Like, at least one, but it, I didn't do the calcs for that, to be fair. Should have really calc that. I want to calc it right now. Dawn fan versus Dingo. That had to be specs. That damage had to be specs. Make it rain. Oh, make it rain like Oko's. Uh, almost 70, 75% of the chan. 75% of the time, make it rain Oko's. Dawn fan, actually. And that's with Spadef bulk, which mine has none. And max HP bulk, which mine definitely does not have. So I think that 100% would have killed me anyways if I didn't have Sturdy. I wonder if it Oko's Ambipom. Because it did get a crit on Ambipom. Oh, I wasn't doing doubles though. I know I should be looking, but I honestly don't care. Yeah, Make It Rain always kills Ambipom at level 50. Actually, in doubles, it never Oko's Dawn fan. Even... Not very effective, Don Fan. Like, not. Oh no, it does Oko. It does Oko if I don't have Spadef. Yikes. I do have some Spadef, though. I have 92. No, I have 92 speed. I have no Spadef. Unfortunate. Um, yeah, I mean, we obviously lead Ambipom here. I think Malamar is a good lead because of Incineroar. Don Fan's a good lead because of all his Pokemon there. And Golduck's just good. And when, when was the last time we used Mascarine? Oh, you know what? Actually, does it Oko? I think I have 160. Okay, so it's actually 68% chance to Oko for Make It Rain. Yeah, Make It Rain has a 60% chance to Oko Dawn fan. Which we technically have like minus 8 HP and we're gonna lose like another 8 there, so. Higher chance to Oko. Okay, this is fine. Um, I think we fake out. I think we just fake out knock off Tornadus and try to kill it. That's a lot of wins. Ah, hello, Monetary. Yeah, this is wins total. Total wins. <laughs> so far from doing the challenge. Don't get it twisted. This is total wins. Do we Psycho Cut? I think we Psycho Cut Tornadus. Hopefully it doesn't have a uh, Covert Cloak. Would be nice. Yes, the Covert Cloak! Calm Mind is fine. We just kill that with Triple Axle. Next turn. Terra Ice, Triple Axle will kill Great Neck. I believe. Yeah. Oh, that doesn't kill? Malamar! Where's your damage, sir? All right. Um, If he does clap. If he does the clap. Wait, do we do this? Do we do... Oh my god, wait, upper hand against clap, because clap is a priority move, right? Do we risk it? Do we risk upper hand here? Oh, do we risk it though? Do we risk it? I should have knocked off, huh? I think knock off would have killed at least. Uh, well, let's just superpower always risk. I mean, he claps here for sure, right? Yeah, he's gonna clap. There's no way he calm mines twice. I refuse to believe it. Let's go! He clapped! Oh! Let's take a go! The, the, the oh my god. Upper hand. First time ever used in any Pokemon match. I swear to god, no one's ever used that before. Oh my god. Okay, that, that, honestly, that feels so good. I'm doing like the Iron Man, like, Puts his hand on his chest and like looks relieved me right now. Cause that was like, I have never had that work for me before. Urshifu, 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 why? But why Urshifu? But why? Urshifu, why do you gotta exist? All right, I think at all plus one will just kill. But I think Malamar just dies anyway, so. That was hype, it was. Oh, he's gonna tear a water here. So this isn't even gonna kill. That's fine. Yeah, that sucks. Terra Water sucks for us. I should have knocked off. 
I mean, I think we just die anyways. Like, Surging Strikes is gonna kill us, and plus one Thunderclap is gonna kill the other guy. Yeah. I mean, what we do here is we just go into that, that, okay, I think, I think we're fine. We go Golduck, we protect on Golduck, because he's gonna clap it with Great Neck. And then we go into Dawn Fan, he's gonna have Surging Palm it. Oh, okay, that's fine. That sucks, but kind of expected. The fact that he was faster than us is really dumb, though. I really hate that he was faster than us. Stupid Tailwind. Man, how did he not die to the... How did Psycho... Oh, I should have knocked off, man. That would have killed him for sure. That he wouldn't be faster than me and I would have been fine. Oh, my God. Unfortunate. All right, Girl Duck Protect here. Don Fane is going to Surging Strikes. We just Seed Bomb Kill. As long as he's not a... Whatchamacallit. it? As long as he's not, uh, what is, what is, focus sashed. Sashed, obviously. Okay. This guy's getting predicted. Even if he hits, if even if he some reason claps, he's not going to clap. He would like Dragon Pulse, Dawn Fan, which would also be unfortunate. Maybe he doubles up on Golduck. That's the dream. He just doubles up on Golduck here. Yeah, clap. Protected. Get, get wrecked, nerd. Surging Strikes, gonna kill me for sure. Except it's not, because Surging Strikes can't do more damage than it can do, because it always crits. Because their Shifu is the most broken son of a bitch ever made. <laughs> I hate her Shifu. Her Shifu and Ogre Pond are my two least liked Pokemon. At least, I mean, in VGC. Okay, good. He was, he, I think he was Scarfed. Okay. If he loses... Okay, how do we do this? Seems unfair that they have legendaries and you don't. I mean, that's literally the challenge I'm playing. <laughs> that's literally the challenge I'm playing, is using random Pokemon. So, I mean, I literally can't. I literally can't get legendaries. In my challenge. What about Zacian? Zacian's fine. I don't care about him. I just really hate Ogre Pond. Like, all forms. Uh, I mean, Raging Bolt kills Golduck 100% of the time. Rillaboom doesn't really kill Dawn Fan here. But we can only Seed Bomb, so we lose. I think we Double Protect. We gotta go for the Legendary Double Protect. We can only Seed Bomb here. I think we lose anyways. It does not matter. It really doesn't matter. Uh, yeah. We lose. Seed Bomb's not gonna do any damage to either of these guys. Unfortunately, we are banded. <laughs> yeah, it just didn't matter. Oh, he can't hit Thunderclap if we protect? Wait, the dream? Actually, the dream here? Okay, okay. Tailwind, did Tailwind Peter out there? Tailwind Petered out. He's not gonna Thunderclap this turn. He's not gonna Thunderclap this turn. I think we double up on the Rillaboom. We can't kill the Raging Bolt with an Ice Beam because he's got a plus one def special defense with the Calm Mind. And I think we just lose anyways here, but I gotta try it. Yeah, Grassy Glide probably just one shots me anyways. Yeah. I hate Rillaboom too. <laughs> That's what Pokemon I hate. I hate Rillaboom. I think Grassy Glide should be like base 30 power for how fucking strong it is. Yeah, we died of that. It was a good try. It was a good try, but he honestly countered us so hard with his team. I definitely should have brought like Masquerade and Politoed or something. I mean, what could I have done differently there? I guess I could have led Dawn Fan and just went to high horsepower immediately. I cannot believe I didn't Oko that stupid Tornadoes. That's like, that pisses me off. I, I mean, I two upped it and it still didn't die. Uh, I thank you for the losey biddies, Ed. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. I deserve them after that stupid grassy quiet Oko's everything. I really don't like that move. I really don't like grassy glide. Ah, go to- hey, Ed. Ed. Go to sleep. 
go to sleep bed. Have a good night. Have a good night, Ed. I hope you sleep all the well today. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You got to get that good, good sleep, especially on the weekends. You know, if you're not getting good sleep on the weekends, your whole weekend plans are just going to be ruined. Go and clap your cheeks. I'll try my best. I'll try my best, but honestly, honestly, I'm getting clapped right now. The uh, freaking great neck over there just absolutely clapped me. You see that? Uh, maybe I should have faked out great neck. Maybe I should have just killed great neck first turn. I should have done that. I should have been playing tricksy footsie with that guy. I should have just Terra iced killed that great neck immediately. And then I could have like, I don't know, done something else. I could have like knocked off that other guy. Is that great boulder? Is that walking wake and great boulder in the same team? Jesus, who plays great boulder? What typing is great boulder? Is that rock psychic? Yikes, 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 uh, yikes, yikes. Water would be decent here, but I don't really need it. Do I need Amber Palm actually? Thinking about it, Amber Palm does nothing to his team. I mean, it kills Whimsicott and it fakes out. But honestly, I think I'm gonna lead. I'm gonna poly. Should I lead these guys? Should I do the good old lead? The good old boys lead of Polytoed Masquerade? That's a decent lead. He's got a lot of physical attackers. I mean, he's got a he's split. So if he leads, no, I kind of want to lead Don Fan, right? Don Fan's a good lead because he has a lot of things weak to it. And if he leads Rillaboom, I just go into Masquerade. Yeah, this is it. He gets minus one. He does zero damage to Masquerade. I mean, he's going to fake out, but that's fine. Great boulder. What do you do against a great boulder? Just hit it with a hydro pump? We don't have hydro pump. I mean, we do have hydro pump. Yikes. This is not the team I wanted to see, actually. Do we Terra Grass? I mean, Terra Grass is kind of a play here. Or do we just tank the a hit? Because we have. Oh, that doesn't even kill. Uh, that's not even super effective. I think we just tank the hit. We have sturdy. We just tank the hit, kill, revenge kill it with high horsepower. Yeah. We just tank the, the water move. Yeah, Tailwind obviously saw that coming a mile away. I should have muddy watered maybe. Hydro Steam, perfectly fine as long as it doesn't burn us, which I don't think it does. Okay, endured the hit. Yeah. Oh, it's life orb. Okay, icy wind. Did a lot more damage to that Whimsicott than I thought it would. That's nice. And honestly, the walking wake too. High horsepower kills here for sure. Okay, not a bad lead. We obviously got tailwind set up on us, but we were slower anyways, so. All right, if he goes into Grassy Glide Monkey here, we could just go straight into... Oh, let's go. All right, that's Masquerade time. I mean, he obviously fakes out here, right? He fakes out. We just do another Icy Wind here. I think we don't tank a... Gra I think we take a minus one Grassy Glide, so I'm not too worried. He might Giga Drain. He might double up. There's no way he doesn't just fake out, right? We just go into Masquerade and we just eat. We just eat. Donphan, come back. These guys aren't worthy of you. Dude, Masquerade was such the play. Oh my god, Masquerade was 100% the play here. He might Giga Drain on Whimsicott and Grassy Clyde. Uh, okay, yeah, fake out. Saw that coming. Okay, okay, predicted. Sunny day. Now, why would you do something like that? That's rude. That's just rude. That's so mean. Um, do I just stay in? I mean, he obviously grassy glides Politoed here. 
Do I just I just protect on Polly, right? He grassy glides Polly. Um struggle bug will probably do a lot of damage. Do I tail him? No, I think I just go for the hurricane. I go for the unrain boosted hurricane here. Does he solar beam? Does he have solar beam on Whimsica? No way, right? If he does, I just swap Polly out this turn with uh with Great Tusk. With normal Tusk. Moonblast. Okay, that's fine. We eat that. Okay, the wood hammer hurts. Okay, unboosted hurricane. R in Jesus, I pray to thee. Sing me to victory. Fuck me. Alright. That's unfortunate. That's unfortunate. Okay, we tanked Dawn Fan here. I think we just go for a struggle bug. Let's go for a neutral hit for just hit them both for a little bit of damage. Their Tailwind's almost over. I could have gone for Tailwind this turn too. I should have done that, huh? Tailwind would have been good. We tank that. We eat up. Get my berry. Num num num. Dunfan dies. Perfectly fine. Yeah, we're faster than them outside because we did minus one them both. So we're definitely faster than both of them. God, the after, the after school, I was going to say after school animations. The after turn animations take so heckin' long. Uh, and I still have to eat my berry. Where's my berry? Sir, where's my berry? Sir, where's my berry? Hello? Does one of those guys have a nerve? Does Whimsicott have a nerve? I refuse to believe that Whimsicott, of all things, has a nerve, right? Okay, yeah, they don't have that anymore. So I'm just going to hurricane here. You can either go for Sunny Day. I know he has Prankster, so he might outspeed me anyways. I should have gone for Protect, huh? Nah. I think it's fine. I want to play a little bit riskier of a game. He goes for the Sunny Day. I think that's a misplay. Who I hit anyways! Let's go! Okay, Icy Wind kills here, and we're faster. No way does Icy Wind miss the Rillaboom. There's no way the Icy Wind misses the Rillaboom. Oh my god. How do we hit? How do we hit the unboosted Hurricane, but miss an Icy Wind? Oh, that's unfortunate, but also very fair. And also, why would you attack him with that? Hello? Excuse me? Sir? Oh, the oh he did have it. Okay. Thanks for the help, I guess. How do you not kill Polytoad there? I mean, even then I won at that point. I was kind of eating at that point. Anyways, like that Rillaboom. Okay, Chi Yu is mm, terrifying? Not that terrifying, actually. Honestly, not that terrifying. I'm just gonna struggle bug here. I should have tailwinded one turn. Yeah, it's fine. Hopefully it's Terra Dark and not Terra Fire. It would help me out a lot. Terra Water is interesting. Um, yeah, it's kind of unfortunate, actually. Grassy Glide, we eat that. Heat Wave. Oh, misses the masquerade. Oh, let's go. RNG is back. Oh my God. It burns the polytoad. We're so back though. We're so back with that miss on the masquerade. Oh, that is so huge. The minus one special attack, I think guarantees us this win here. Oh my God. Do I swap polytoad for the, no, that's so dumb. I was going to say, should I swap polytoad to get rain back in? But no, that's really dumb. Okay, no accuracy drop. Unfortunate. That would have been really good with that heat wave. Okay, we don't die this turn. Um, with heat wave, it doesn't matter though. Yeah, minus one special attack. I think Malamar can live at least one, even with this with this sun. I think we survive at least one. 
If he misses again, though, that'd be so nice. Yeah, no. Okay, it's Malamar 1v1. I can't even Terra here. What is my Masquerade's Terra? Maybe I should have Terra'd on Masquerade to try and tank one more. Man, if I'm Terra Water on Masquerade, I'm going to be pissed. Terra Bug. Okay, it didn't matter. I should really put Terra Water on Masquerade. All right. Yeah. Do we go for like knockoff here? I think it's probably specs, right? I think knockoff is a pretty neutrally good move here. I don't think superpower is going to do anymore. And I don't need physical defense or attack here. It's either going to kill or not. And we're definitely not dying here. Assault Vest Malamar ain't going to die. And I think if we knock off, we have a chance of two living two. After the sun ends, for sure. Okay, huge. Oh, it was a booster energy. Oh, that's unfortunate. It was a booster energy. Okay, it's a roll. It's a roll. He either misses here or he gets a low roll. Let's go! Let's go! He got the low roll! Oh my god! The 6 HP in a dream! I didn't even notice. I didn't even read the thing he had booster energy because he was in the sun, right? So it didn't even matter. Oh my god. Oh. My heart. My heart. My heart is pounding. Whew. That was too close, man. That was too close. Not cool, video game. Be less close next time. I don't want it to be on a roll, man. That was, he literally, he, maybe he high rolled the first hit, actually. That's also possible. Oh, the assault vest coming in clutch. I was really hoping that was a spec. Why would you, why, why would you not like, why would you heat wave, though? There's no way he didn't have a better single target damage move, right? What is... What does Chiyu run? Like, if it's not a choice specs, what do they run? What moves? I mean, Heat Wave, Dark Pulse, Overheat. There's no way he wasn't running Overheat, right? What was he running? Was he seriously not running Overheat? Overheat would have killed me for sure. That's like the only other move these people run. Unless he was running Nasty Pot. He could have been running Nasty Pot, Heat Wave, Dark Pulse, and Protect, I guess. The safety goggles. Interesting. Wait. Oh my god. I can't believe you wouldn't run Overheat, though. That's so fortunate for me. Oh, why is he ranked seven? He's in Great Ball tier. That's not fair. Look, I'm finding a Great Ball tier guy. That's just not fair. That's just not fair. All right, we're going to lead Mally to deal with like two things. We're going to lead Donnie to deal with nothing because Donnie dies to everything here, actually. Uh, let's lead Ambi because who doesn't love a little bit of Ambien in their life? Um, can't bring a water guy. I'm gonna bring Masquerade. Masquerade's a pretty decent counter to that uh, Wellspring. Because we can't use water Pokemon with that thing on the team. Uh, it's fine because Earth Shifu, if they do, no, if they do run Blood Moon Usaluna, they're 100% gonna tear a normal Blood Moon, so that's not even an issue. Man, it's crazy how we went from having moves like Hyper Beam to having moves like Blood Moon. Which is literally just way better Hyper Beam. It's insane. Imagine if they gave that to Slaking and then you just swap the uh, ability off with Slaking. It just goes to town with Blood Moon. Oh my god. That's what I want. I want a Blood Moon Slaking. Okay, that's actually really bad. Okay, we got the attack up, which is good. I'm expecting Spiky Shield Parting Shot here. So I'm actually going to do this and this. I'm going to double up on the Ensign. I'm expecting Spiky Shield. He could also just hit me with a move, but that's fine. Okay, so he's not Spiky Shielding. That Incineroar is going to die, which is really good for me. Ivy Cudgel. That's fine. Honestly, kill the Ambipom. The crit. Yeah, whatever, Dave. 
Well, I mean, we crit him, yeah, but we crit him with fake out. Okay, this is fine, actually. We go into Masquerade here. Okay, that's really good. Malmar's at plus two attack, plus one defense, which is really good, actually, for us. Really, really good. We're going to go into Donnie. Or not Donnie. Absolutely not going into Donnie here. Actually, no. We're not going into normal Tusk here. I should give my Pokemon nicknames. Okay, Masquerade's really good here. Urshifu is interesting. Intimidate doesn't matter. Ugh. So this is... We are plus one defense. I think we Terra Steel here. Terra Steel... He's gonna Terra Water. I think we just Terra Steel Superpower Urshifu. And we're just going to... Damn. Tailwind, tailwind. Do I tailwind here? Do I tailwind here? Do I tailwind here? Yeah, why not? Detect is fine. It's not great. It's really not good. But it's fine, actually. Oh, the crit! Oh! Is I even cudgel 100% crit? I don't think so, right? There's no way this guy just got two crits in a row, right? <laughs> right? I refuse to believe this guy got two crits in a row. All right, we kill our Shifu there because we're faster and we're just going to Hurricane Ogre Pond base. Is that way it's is, is Ivy Cut to 100% crit? I don't remember it being. I mean, he Terra Waters here, right? Also, where was my Terra Steel there? I thought I quit Terra Steel. Hmm. Good thing I didn't. Follow me. Uh, oh, he just sucker punched anyways. Okay. Um. Yeah, fair enough. I mean, it's really unfortunate that that Ivy Kajo crit us. Oh, we hit? Okay, that's decent damage. All right, Donnie boy here. We're going to Terra Grass Seed Bomb. And we're just going to... I guess we go for another Hurricane, right? Why does that... Why is that not super effective? Why is that not super effective? Does fighting resist grass in this gym? What? Fighting doesn't resist grass, right? Am I crazy? Am I insane? Sucker Punch is fine. Like, really fine. I don't know why you would do it. He might be Scarf, huh? Where's my Terra? Hello? Did I not click Terra again? Did I seriously not click Terra again? Okay, it's fine that I didn't click Terra, actually. It's actually fine. It's not fine that I missed the hurricane, but everything else is fine. Okay, we gotta go for the... The actual stuff here. Hurricane's gotta hit this turn or else I lose. What does fighting resist? It doesn't resist grass, so I'm really confused. Why is Seed Bomb not super effective against Urshifu? He's got Detect. Yeah, he's obviously not Scarfed. I don't know why I thought he was Scarfed. Spiky Shield. Also fine. I mean, this is fine. I mean, this is not fine, because we don't have speed on our side anymore. Oh, we just lose. Huh. 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 I really love legendaries. I really love these two Pokemon specifically. I fucking love Urshifu and Ogre Pond. My favorite Pokemon. My favorite Pokemon by far. Urshifu and uh, Ogre Pond. I was really happy to fight them today. They're not busted at all. Oh. Ivy Cudgel just has a heightened chance to crit. So he just got those two crits. Naturally. To absolutely end my career. That's fun. I mean, the first one didn't matter, but the second one 100% mattered. We would not have died to a minus one sucker punch there. I don't think if we didn't get crit, because he was at minus one. And we we're at plus one defense, so there's no way that crit didn't matter. We live that. 
We don't live that. We live that? No crit this time, Ogre Pom! Oh my god. Oh my Hey, how's that crit for you, bitch? <laughs> Fuck you, Ogre Pom. Okay, Seed Bomb. Kill the Urshifu at this range when you're Terrid, for sure. All right, what, what's he got? What's he got? Do we have any any chance of winning here? Any chance of winning? Any at all? I'll take. I'll take any chance of winning here. Yikes. Um, I think we're faster. Actually, I think we're faster. I think we're good. Aren't we faster here? I mean, he's going to. I think it's fine. There's no way we don't outspeed or something. I mean, protect. Sure, fine. Who are you helping with that? He's gonna tear a normal here for sure, which is fine. I think a, I think we win if we're not like really unlucky with like a miss here, with like two hydro pump misses. I think we win. I mean, he kills obviously. He kills any of my Pokemon in a single hit. Not even questioning that. But as long as we hit at least one hydro, I think we win here because he obviously kills. The Terrid Pokemon first with Blood Moon. Or anything, really. Oh, he might have Hyper Voice. I might die. Alright, we hit. That did no damage. Love to see that. Banded Seed Bomb. He's not defensive. He is defensive. If he Hyper Voices me, I lose. Ah, oh, no! I should have went for the... I should have went for the... Oh, we didn't die. 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 Do I get my berry from this? Okay, he's life orbed. He's actually in hydro pump range now. If I got my berry there, I think I would have struggle bugged. Because I would have tanked it then. Okay. We gotta pray to RNG Jesus. If we hit hydro pump, we win. If we lose, if we miss, we lose. Let's go! Let's go! It's a crit! It didn't matter, but let's go! Oh my god, masquerade hitting double crits that don't matter in this game. Let's go! 56 wins on the clock. Oh my god. We won the double coin flip there. We needed both Hydros to win. I didn't think Ursaluna would be that physically tanky. I know he's specially tanky. Or no, he's physically tanky, isn't he? But he's not specially tanky, or is it the... I don't know. I, I don't remember which one. I forgot his stats. He's really good. Except for speed. Oh my god, I can't believe we won that. <laughs> Did we hit Great Ball? No, we still need one more win for Great Ball. Oh. Yeah, so he's not specially defensive. He's really physically defensive. 120 base physical defense and 65 base special defense. So the fact that my Hydro Pump did that little damage just shows you how bad Masquerade is. Masquerade is so bad. His stats are trash. He's got like, like baby Pokemon stats. I swear to God. Uh, Masquerade really just needs a s slight special attack buff. He needs to get like 95 special attack and he needs like 80 base speed at least. I think this is ridiculous. Buff Masquerade, Nintendo. Game Freak, buff Masquerade. I'm not asking too much here. Give Masquerade a buff. He deserves it. Also, this team is terrifying. Okay, we obviously lead Ambi plus Mally here. Mm, I don't think he's going to use Ogre Pond when I have a team full of guys that kill Ogre Pond, right? He's probably he's probably going to run King Gambit and Tornadus in front. So I'm going to lead these guys in the back, I think. I think I lead po I, th I think he's Politoed for rain here just in case he does bring in No. Hmm. Masquerade doesn't really help here either. I mean, he does. I mean, he does. Do I bring Dawn Fan? I mean, I would have to bring Politoed. Uh, maybe I'll lead Politoed and sort of. No. I mean, this is hard. I kind of bring Politoed, but also I kind of want to bring Golduck. 
Also, I kind of want to bring Masquerain. Bring Golduck. All right, if he leads Lando, I'll be happy. I'm gonna be a happy man if he leads Lando. That would make me incredibly happy. I mean, I just, I just go in, I just kill, I just murder. Lando, pshaw. I say pshaw to that. Yeah, this is what I thought would happen. I mean, he's gonna outspeed me anyways. But I kind of have to do this, I think. If he detects, though, I mean, I lose. If he detects, I lose. Simple as that. If he detects, I lose. And I think he's going to go for the detect. So I'm actually going to do this. I think I think this is the better play. He didn't detect! Oh my god. I lose. I've lost. Fucking surging strikes. The stupidest move in the game. Okay, if Malamar Oko is here is the only way. Malamar Okoing is the only way I survived this fight. I can't believe he didn't detect there. If I if I got I should have I should have hit him. I should have hit him with it. I need that Oko. Not even half Malamar. Get some help. I think I just give up. I think I'm just gonna give up. I think I'm just gonna give up this fight, actually. Alright, let's see if we can bring this back in from the clutches of defeat. God, son of a bitch. I'm so tired of this team. I'm so tired of their team. Not my team. My team rocks. I'm so tired of their team. I swear to God, it's always Tornadus, Urshifu, fucking some flavor of Ogre Pawn, and then some weird ass fourth Pokemon. The like Rillaboom or Incineroar or something. It's like, do these people play Pokemon, like, at all? Oh, Donphan avoiding that's huge. And Malamar avoiding that's huge. Surging strikes on the Dawn fan, huge. Okay, we might be coming back from this. Maybe I should have Ice Spinnered there instead. Nah, heck it. This is the way. That did really decent damage, but it doesn't really matter. Okay, Seed Bomb hits. Missing Bleak Wind on both Pokemon was so good for me. All right, now we're kind of in the neutral play. He's obviously got a huge advantage in that he's got speed. I'm so surprised it didn't detect there. I guess maybe he just didn't feel like he needed to protect there. Oh no, that's really bad for me. Yeah, yeah, I lose. I definitely lose. I definitely lose this, right? Ain't no way, ain't no way I survived this. I'll try anyways. Yeah. And then Bleak Wind kills both my Pokemon here. Ooh, Malamar survived. Huh. Interesting. All right, uh, maybe Crit Knockoff here. Crit Knockoff? No? Never lucky? I thought so. All right, I need misses. I need another miss. If Tornadus misses again, I think I can bring it back. I need Tornadus to double miss again. Would be nice. Would be nice. Tornadus at least miss Malamar. Oh, oh, ho. Okay, Golda. Ah, oh, you're kidding. You're kidding. Couldn't double miss again. Heck, a nerd. All right, yeah, we lost. I'm so tired. This man's playing the most generic team in the world. I'm so tired of it. I'm so tired of seeing Urshifu. And Tornadus. I'm so tired of them. Oh my gosh, it's Ogre Pwn. Oh, it's Landorus. Yo, Lando. Why didn't you lead Lando, you little punk? Would've been great. Would've been great. I would've won here. I would have won here if that Flutter main was dead, which I would have happened if Bleak Wind missed. Because I'm pretty sure Golduck might outspeed Lando here and kill it with an Ice Beam. I would have won. I would have won, man. I would have won. I could have still brought... Oh, wait, no. He just Terra's, of course. Why would I even think he wouldn't Terra Lando here? Like, he's got... Oh. I thought he would, like, Terra Water Lando, but... 
That was this this was technically winnable, but yeah, there's no way I tank this, so it doesn't we're not even gonna see if I outspeed. I should have killed Tornadus, right? I think that was a misplay. I should have killed Tornadus instead of using knockoff on Fluttermane. I if I double dumped on Tornadus there, I wouldn't have died. Both my Pokemon would have been alive. I could have ice beamed Lando and then knocked off. No, I would have still lost. It didn't matter. Because that guy would have still had two 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 lives. Yeah, I would have lost. It didn't matter. I would have had need I would have needed a crit either way. And I didn't get it, so it's fine. Golly. Alright. Oh I mean it feels so good beating those teams, but it's just it's just so demotivating fighting them over and over again. Because it's like, do people just not make their own teams anymore? Or do they just all use like battle codes? See this, this is a weird ass team. I like it. It's probably Terra Normal. That Dragonite though, so that's terrifying. I mean, Mass Rain's actually not bad here. The Intim is good on like multiple Pokemon. Flying type is good against Gallade. Golduck would have been fine, I guess, for Terra Ground. I don't know. Politoed would have been meh. I'm going to fake out Superpower Dragonite because I think it's just going to immediately... It's just immediately going to Terra Normal E-Speed everything. And I'm pretty sure it's Banded, so he's not going to be Clear Amulet or... Not Clear Amulet. What's the one? Covert Cloak? Stops flinching? Stops like secondary effects. He's probably gonna lead that and I don't know, mimic here or something. Oh. Oh. Well. It's not what I was expecting. It's kind of sick though. I respect it. I mean, I respect the hell out of this. This is all. I, I haven't seen a Gengar in 30 years. I really respect Gengar. And Mimikyu. I love Mimikyu. Mimikyu was actually a Pokemon I specifically used in Gen 7 uh, competitive. It was really fun. Shadow Ball might kill. No, no way. It's neutral. Yeah, we, we tank. Swords Dance is fine. We outspeed it with Ambipom. I mean, Shadow Sneak can't even kill Ambipom here, so. Gengar. Gengar living. Oh, wait, what knockoff doesn't beat Focus Sash? Aw, oh, come on, game. Have a heart. Have a heart. Can't believe knockoff doesn't beat Focus Ash. Yeah, that's fair. We tank it though. Oh, I should have killed the Gengar with Ambipom. That was really bad. Because now Malamar dies for no reason. God dang it. Misplay. Misplay. I was even thinking it and I just didn't do it. God dang it. That was a huge misplay. Destiny Bond. Oh no. Wait. Oh. Huh. <laughs> I mean, Malamar was going to die to a Shadow Ball anyways. It didn't really matter. That's fine. I mean, as long as it doesn't kill Ambipom too. Like, does it kill Ambipom too? God, I hope not. That would be... I'd be, I'd be pissed. Are you kidding me? I would run Gengar's Scarf and just keep throwing out Destiny Bonds at that point if it killed both Pokemon in a doubles fight. Oh, that's bad. Well, I mean, we kind of tank it. He's going to tear a normal here. Do we tear a grass? He probably kills Ambi here. Do I swap Ambi for Masquerade? I think I definitely swap Ambi for Masquerade here. And I might just... Do I even tear a grass? What would be the point? If he's got like Ice Punch? I'm just going to high horsepower Gallade. I think it's fine. I want a high horsepower here just because I don't want to do it on Dragonite this turn in case he doesn't Terra Normal, which would be wild to not. Oh, uh, clear amulet on Gallade and inner focus on Dragonite? Shit. <laughs> he got me. He played me like a fiddle. Oh my god. And it's still fine. Yeah, predict. Oh, Terra Steel? 
Damn, imagine if I high horse powered Dragonite right now. Holy crap. That's we tank. Iron Head. Oh my god, you absolute fool. Does what? I'm pissed. I'm so pissed right now. Oh my god. I am incredibly pissed. Why the first the flinch? First of all, I thought ground resisted steel moves. Is that not a thing anymore? Does ground not resist steel moves? How does that do that much damage? Why would you target Master in there? <laughs> What are you people doing? Yeah, I mean, you knew I was gonna high horsepower Dragonite, right? I'm. He had the win. He had the win on a silver platter handed to him. I think. He just threw. Did he think I was gonna protect on Don? I mean, that's actually fair. It, most people probably don't think I'm running, you know, choice band on fan. That's pretty fair. All right. Well, now I just win here. But still, I mean, ah, uh, I mean, I thought ground types resisted steel moves. I could have, if you, if you put a gun to my head and be, be like, does ground types resist steel moves? I would 100% said yes. They've never resisted steel moves. Really? Huh. I mean, I won. <laughs> I mean, I did win. I mean, I did win. I mean, would I have lost there? I'm thinking. Amber Palm flinches Dragonite. Masquerade kills Golade. Amber Palm Terra Ices. Double, triple axles. That guy does the Iron Head. Masquerade. Hydro Pumps. Maybe kills? Hmm. Oh my god. I was thinking, wow, this team looks interesting. A Latias, a Milotic, and then I see everything else and I'm like, oh, yeah, this is just a normal team. Alright, let's lead, 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 lead. I mean, Golduck. Wait, Masquerade though, actually. Yeah. Get more, I mean, if I just had like a really good flying type Pokemon, I wouldn't take it over Masquerade. Or at least a decent bug type. Imagine if I got like a Volcarona. That would be an amazing Pokemon for my team, actually. A Volcarona? Are you kidding me? With like Flame Body? No. I was thinking it would be good against Urshifu, but crits go through even burn damage, right? Burn attack reduction. Nice! The Intim. Okay. Let's double up on Incineroar again. We'll leave the Milotic to kill me. Which is fine. We're just going to superpower Incin. This is fine. Maybe I should have... Do I outspeed Incin with Palmar? I really should learn that. I should really learn Incin speed. I guess it didn't matter. I would have been slowed down by Ice Wind anyways. <gasps> you fool! You have made me more powerful than you could have imagined! Thank God I didn't flinch my Lodic. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. Oh my God. Plus speed Malabar is the dream. It needs plus two attack, plus one defense. Crinolato? That, oh my God. It's my birthday. It's my birthday. That's the, oh wait, like this is gonna be. It must be my birthday. Cause I'm about to Terra steal this man. Oh my God. This is like best possible outcome. This is best possible outcome. Best possible outcome actually is if he icy wins again. Oh, hey, nice competitive. Jeez, I didn't know my Lodic got that. That's unfortunate. Oh, Terra, Terra what now? Terra Fairy? I thought it was gonna be Terra Ghost. Oh, it's actually Terra Fairy. Oh, the dream. They never expect the Terra Steel Malamar. I use it specifically for these guys. 
Terra Steel Malamar. Terra Steel Malamar. He's too powerful. Look at him. He's going to stab you with that axe. This poor man. He outspeeds me, which is fair. It's going to do zero damage. Doesn't even do that much damage to Masquerade, surprisingly. We have a really weird EV spread on Masquerade. I don't remember what it was. And we kill him, Crinia Shaw. We might get Hydra Punk by this uh, this guy though. He might be able to take down Malamar. Or he's just gonna Icy Wind again. He was really expecting that kill on Malamar. Which is great for me. <laughs> uh, Malamar is too good, man. Malamar, he's at plus two, plus one, plus two. What a beautiful Pokemon. Yeah, make me faster. Make me even faster. He, lo he lost his Terra. Okay, Ogre Pond. Ogre Pond comes in here. Stupid little Ogre Pond. I'm going to struggle, Bug. And I'm going to knock off this Ogre Pond. He might even... He's probably going to Spiky Shield. Yeah, I should have seen that coming. I should have seen that coming. Knock off. Going to do some damage to me. That's fine. I should have seen that coming. Malmar might die to a Hydra Pump here. And let's see, just Icy wins me again. Is this guy on crack? Is this man on crack cocaine? I'm so confused at what his endgame here is. Because, I mean, Ogre Pond just dies. He just Oko's now. I just Oko him. I mean, I'm just going to Dawn Fan it. I mean, there's no way Fake Out doesn't Oko his whole team at this point. And I'm at, he, does he not know that he's giving me speed? Maybe he's not paying attention. Maybe he doesn't understand that he's actually increasing my speed? How does that not kill? Oh, wow. That did zero damage. The fact that he didn't do that to the normal Tusk is... Interesting. Very, very interesting. Wow, that did a lot more damage than Dawn Fan. Oh, I mean, he is plus special attack. That makes sense. And Ogre Pond doesn't lose its item, right? I could just knock off again. Ooh, that did more damage than I thought. Oh, he's Berry Milotic. Okay. I was about to say he might be freaking Specs Milotic because he's only using this one move. I mean, you just knock off again, right? I could superpower. Oh, you know, he's probably going to do that again. I'm going to superpower my Lodic. Oh, he didn't spike me shield that time? Oop. Ooh, that's really bad for me. That's a yikes. That's a, that's a yikes right there. Did I just lose? Did I just lose? Because I didn't kill the Milotic. So it's going to be a 1v2 for me. I lost. I think I just lost. Miss! 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 No! I thought it was a miss. I really was expecting the I, the spiky shield. Why would you not spiky shield in that position? Alright. Amber Palm. Um, dies. Dies. Amber Palm dies. Amber Palm dies. Amber Palm dies. Amber Palm dies. Eh. I mean, I don't think we died at two icy wins, maybe. So maybe we don't die. Maybe we kill. Maybe we don't. If he spiky shields on this turn, I'm gonna cry like a little baby. All right, killed Ogre Pond. Let's see if this kills and or makes me slower than him next turn. All right, the fact that I didn't kill the Milotic is insane to me. He could also miss Life Dew. Okay, 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 okay. That's interesting because that heals nothing. I think we, I think we, just, I think we just, I think we just won. We pulled it back. Oh my God, I threw so hard. And then I just, I just pulled it back. You know, I just pulled it back right out of the ground like a freaking turn up. Oh my God. He really threw me off by not spiky shielding on that Ogre Pond. And I'm also surprised that the plus two didn't kill the Milotic from the superpower. Oh, we pulled it back. 58 wins, two more wins to another Pokemon. We've gotten seven wins today.
That's got to be a new record for me because I'm really bad at this video game. It's got to be a new record. Oh my god. I'm, I'm just, I'm blown away that we just won that fight. How? How did we win that? I threw so hard. I mean, the life dude. We lost because of life. I mean, we won because of life dude. Great ball rank. Let's go. I mean, why would you click life do there? Did, I mean, he maybe expected Ogre Pond to live and attack or outspeed me, but even in any situation there, you don't life do. It boggles the mind. It also boggles the mind that he didn't spiky shield that turn to save his guy and then kill Malamar. And the fact that he just kept icy winding that whole time. That guy was on crack cocaine. I'm telling you, that guy is wacky. All right. I mean, this is definitely a Politoed match. Is this even a Dawn fan match? She's got plenty of things that Dawn fans not good against, but the Electabuzz. And honestly, The Golurk and the the Guard Chomp he's also good against. Am I good against Malamar? Why would I run Malamar here? Superpower. I mean, superpower against Selatin and that guy. That's pretty good. That's about it. I mean, I mean, knockoff against Golurk. Golduck kind of just runs up them better though. Right? I mean, Golurk kind of just. I mean, I mean, right? I mean, I mean, right? I mean, I mean, this lead actually kind of hot though. This lead, Don Fan Amber Palm, kind of sexy though. That sounds really weird. I'm not gonna say that anymore. Uh, Masquerade, meh. Golduck, mm, not bad, not bad, not bad. Malamar, also not bad. I'm gonna run Golduck for the speed though. What is Sedatan's ability? I've never seen anyone use a Sedatan before. What does it even do? Yo, Sedatan's shiny form is sick. Holy crap. Uh, it's got Slush Rush. Oh, he's playing Sand. That's not bad for me. I mean, I don't even need to fake out. I outspeed Garchomp here. I just, I just take it out. I just kill it with Triple Axle. He's not even using Sand. Okay. He, he showed his ability, right? I was not paying attention. What? Did it show his ability? God dang it. I wasn't paying attention. I mean, he's not levitate, right? I don't think he was levitate. I think he was the normalizing gas. God dang it. When you type in wheezing on Google, it doesn't even, it just brings it to like a bunch of WebMDs. All right, yeah, probably the guard chomp, right? Damn it, that's unfortunate. That's really unfortunate. I should have, I should have faked out. That's unfortunate, but what are you gonna do? All right, he's probably gonna EQ. Wait, was that, was that, was that, was that, was that levitate? Okay, no, he's stopping Trancham. Okay, he's not EQ, that's fine. All right, that thing's dead, and we're in a pretty good position. Should've killed the Amber Palm. Okay, neutralizing gas is gone, that's fine. Is he? No, cause he wasn't even, what? I mean, now I can just do it against Golurk. <laughs> I outspeed. Oh, nice protect, nerd. What? Are, does Garchomp have other abilities besides Sandstorm and uh, the the rough skin? No, so... Oh, Garchomp doesn't have Sandstorm. He's got Sand Veil. Oh, what am I even saying? Why did I think Garchomp brought Sand? I... Huh. I might be an insane person. Why is Garchomp so tiny? Why is that such a short, squat Garchomp? I thought he was taller than that. And like all the art you see with like him and Cynthia, you just expect Garchomp to be a little taller. 
I don't know. I'm just going to keep doing this, though. Heck, it's working. Okay. <laughs> I mean, okay. I ain't too worried about Electabuzz. I mean, uh, Headlog Rush is going to hurt me, but it, it it doesn't crit. Or Stomping Rush, Tantrum, we don't die to a non-crit. We kill, revenge kill. And now he has that he has a choice. Oh, so he does have rough skin. Oh, so it was just the neutralizing gas stopped the rough skin. Thank God, or my ammo palm would be dead. <laughs> With triple axle. Oh no. It's fine. We are just gaming today. Holy crap. Like actual gaming today. Yeah, 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 yeah. It didn't even give me the final hit. Boo. Yeah, that's fair. We destroyed him. Oh my god, we're so good today. I'm telling you, this Don fan rounds out our team so well. I mean, we're also getting like non-insane battles. I mean, no, we're getting a lot of like Urshifu Ogre Pond battles that we're losing, but we're also getting a lot of like rando teams, which I'm loving. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Mm. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Next fight. Maybe we'll get to rank eight today because I'm only going to do a few more fights because I'm getting my throats dying. So I can only do a few more fights today, but maybe we can get to rank eight. Maybe we could get 60 wins and get a new Pokemon. That'd be wild. I don't think I've ever gotten a whole new Pokemon after the last one in a single stream before. There we go. Okay, the Metagross? Okay. Okay, wait a minute. He's got the fish, but he doesn't have the Tatsumaki. But why? Why would you run big fish without tiny fish? I don't understand. I mean, that's fine. I'm just going to run these guys in the front. I kill most things that come out this way, except for... I don't know. I think it's fine. Run Don Fan in the back. Should I bring Masquerade? I'm going to bring Masquerade. No, because that guy's got inner focus. I mean, Masquerade hits Meta. No, Metagross also has clear body. And he doesn't really deal with anything. Golduck here is good. Terra Ground hurts a few things. And Water Type's not bad. Uh, better than Politoed here. All right, this is going to be interesting. I've never seen anyone bring in that Rock Poison type Pokemon whose name I don't remember and actually use it in a fight. <laughs> they always have it on their team. I've never seen them use it. That's a cute Umbreon. I love shiny Umbreon. Man, I don't know. Every time I remember Umbreon, I remember Umbreon and Espeon. I remember Pokemon Colseer when I'm sad we don't have more. But he actually brought it. Oh, that's interesting. I've never seen them actually bring it. All right. I'm just going to fake out Superpower that guy. Oh, should I Psycho Cut? I think I'm going to Superpower this guy. I don't like this guy. I don't like this fish. I don't like this fish. Hopefully he doesn't protect and I cry. What's he going to do? Set up Toxic Spikes here? That's fine. No, he wouldn't set up Toxic Spikes. That's his ability, right? He gets hit and then he sets up Toxic Spikes. Yeah, that's fine. It's like a stall team. He's really uh, taking his time. Okay, fake out huge. Didn't protect. Nice crit. Power gem, that's fine. We tank that. Hell yeah, Ambipom actually lived that. I wasn't actually thinking he would die. Wow, that thing is tanky. Holy crap, what is your defense level, sir? She. Like, actually, she. Yeah, that's a leftovers. All right, if he's going to rock gem me again, maybe I should go into a Dawn fan here and Terra Grass. I don't want to risk, though. I might just die. I might just risk and die. I really want to get rid of this guy. I'm not too worried about that guy. I'm just going to double up on this guy again. Hopefully he doesn't protect again. No, he's going to think I'm going to double up twice. 
But if Animal Palm dies here, I'm just going to go into Dawn Fan, Terra Grass, and hope he doesn't do a poison move. Because why would you do a poison move against the ground type? That doesn't make any sense. I know at least ground types resist poison, right? I'm not crazy. Hopefully. Man, so you got to choose your moves. With Drew. Oh, that's good for me. Means one less thing to hit me. All right. Maybe I can get it like a good crit. Okay. That's fine. That's so bad damage. That's such bad damage. Okay. That thing's going to die next turn. He's probably going to wave crash Amba Bomb here since he swapped, right? Yawn is interesting. Okay, so he's going to E-speed here. I'm not going to swap Mal Malamar. I'm going to keep Malamar up. I'm going to double hit Superpower again. No, I'm going to triple Axel. Because Malamar kills this guy anyways. So I'm just going to do this. I mean, he's probably going to Terra normal E-speed kill Ambipom. That's fine. I'll tank that all day. If he does that, and Malamar's asleep, I might Terra Steel on the sleeping Malamar just to tank. Okay, Protect is normal. That makes sense. He didn't... He... He did E-Speed. Okay. Fortunate! But also very fair. Unfortunate. He So he did have Protect. I just got lucky he didn't use it twice when I doubled up on this fat... Fat... Fat Hecker. He's so tanky. All right, I'm really scared that this thing is going to kill all my Pokemon. And now that I'm asleep, I might just lose. Um, yeah. yeah. I'm going to Terra Steel Malamar. No, I'm not going to Terra Steel Malamar because I'm at plus two. I think I tank an E-Speed anyways. So I'm just going to kill this thing and then try to wake up. And if he does e-speed me and it does more than half, I'll Terra Steel. And hopefully that won't that won't kill me then unless he gets like a crit. But I think he's probably gonna Terra now. Yeah, Terra normal now. I definitely outspeed that, kill that thing with that. Yeah, Terra normal e-speed. This is definitely banded. I'm pretty sure both my Pokemon live at least one hit. I mean, I know Dawn Fan does. He's got Sturdy. Yeah, he definitely lives. Yeah, easily eats that. Oh, Malamar. Nom, 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 nom. Eats that up. All right, I might Terra Steel this turn. Maybe I should have Terra Steeled, but I didn't want to risk it for the biscuit, you know? Oh, my God. Look at my little, look at my little normal tusk out there. I love normal tusk. I mean, we just kill that guy. I don't think he's got an air balloon. It didn't say anything about air balloons, so I'm pretty sure he doesn't have it. Where's my Terra? Hello, Terra? I guess it didn't matter, but where was my where's my Terra? I did click the Terra button. I swear to God, I just clicked the Terra button, right? Am I crazy? I mean, that kills. Oh, okay. Okay, Donphan dies. What's the play here? Donphan dies 100% of the time. I live with... Okay, I am clicking it this time. I killed this guy. No, I hit the, I hit this. I got to try to kill this guy. Man, if I Terra Steel two turns ago, I would have won for sure. Because I would have taken no damage. And if I Terra that turn, I would have taken even less damage and probably survived like anything. I'm so pissed. I swear to God, I clicked the button. I must have went back one extra one time and just did too much. Yeah, he's dead for sure. Poor Don fan. Can only tank two of that despite being really tanky. I think Golduck dies to a single hit here. Yeah, I think I think I think two of those actually. 
Malamar, come on, it's been three turns. I'm gonna lose to sleep fucking RNG. That's great. Uh, do I protect on Golduck here? I think I do. That's, do I protect on Golduck here? Huge decision. You can either kill this guy. I think I kill, I have to go for the kill here. Yeah. Ah, should have protected, 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 protected, unless I die here anyway. Should have protected, should have protected. I died here anyways, it didn't matter. <laughs> it actually, funnily enough, ended up not mattering. No, I should have protected, because I, I, yeah, no, I should have protected. It did matter. Okay, if this doesn't Oko, I lose. Let's go! Huge! I think we outspeed. Do we outspeed? I wasn't paying attention. I should have protected. Heck, 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 heck. Should have protected, man. I would guarantee win here with protect. Now it's now it's a roll because I 100% don't know if I live a power gem at this range or if I outspeed at this range. It is a real big roll here. He had another Pokemon? Oh, well, it didn't matter. I could have sworn he didn't have another Pokemon. If you put a gun to my head, I would have said he has no more Pokemon in the back. I thought I killed three already. Wow, if I protected there, I could have won. Maybe. Yeah, it's fine. That was a good fight. It was a huge misplay on my fight. I swear to God, I hit I hit it like way earlier. Like I hit Terra Steel at least like two turns ago. Also, I got really bad RNG with those sleep turns. If I'd gotten a little like one turn woke up early RNG there. There was a chance, because then Golduck would have survived. Maybe wouldn't have even... If I had woke up early enough, I wouldn't have had even had to Terra there. And that could have Terra grounded and killed the other guy. Also, if that guy didn't survive, because he had a freaking thing... Ah, it's fine. Lots of things I could have done better there, for sure. Really unfortunate. I really thought he had no more Pokemon left. And man, that just that's not great. I don't like that team. Um, so he's gonna lead Whimsicott Walking Wake, probably. That's what they always do when they have those two. So to counter that. How the hell do I counter that again? I'm gonna fake out the Whimsicott. Dragon Water. I mean, do I just Malamar superpower then? And the Masquerade isn't terrible. Eh. I like the Golduck speed if he does go into Pelipper. What do I do against Walking Wake? I really don't have a lot of good things against Walking Wake. I don't have any fairy type Pokemon or fairy type moves on my team, I don't think. I think I could put Play Rough on Dawn Fan, but that seems a little much. Oh! Well, that's certainly something. He breaks the mold. Do I fake out him? No. I mean, I fake out this guy. He's gonna spiky shield, so I just fake out. And knock off, right? Psycho cut. Can I kill with a fake out psycho cut on this guy? Do I dare risk it? I mean, there's no way he doesn't spiky shield, right? He spiky shields. Should I just not even go for the fake out? Should I go for the triple axle? Just kill this guy off the bat. Not let him set up like a sunny day. I think that's the play. And then I'm just gonna superpower this this slot. Okay, he's gonna kill me. He's just gonna murder me right in the face. Fun. I love that. Doesn't that guy look like a Spectrobe? Have you guys ever played Spectrobe? That guy looks like the, the Kuma guy from Spectrobe. I forgot his name. All right, so he didn't spike his shield. I think that means I lose, because he's just gonna kill Ambipom here. Oh, or Malamar. Just one-shot Malamar with a non-super effective move. 
That's fun. Or no, not non stab me. Okay, at least I killed Whimsicott. Woo! Should have flinched that bitch. I mean, I go into Dawn Fan and then I Terra Grass, right? Because he's going to Horn Leech. Yeah, that's the play. Fucking yikes. Ooh, that's bad. He really had to bring the Walking Wake into here. I mean, it's fine. Maybe he doesn't Horn Leech me anymore, though, which is unfortunate. Ah, hello, Cat Lover. Thank you for the Hydrate. Thanks, Scott, for all that. Oh. Go. All right. All right. How you doing, though, Cat Lover? How's your, uh, how's your day going? How is your Friday? I just Terra Grass. I gotta do this. This is the play. Where's my Terra? I swear to God, Terra doesn't exist. Thank God I didn't Terra. I mean, it didn't matter. I got one shot. Uh, oops. And then he's definitely dead. How did he outspeed me? Is that Garb? Any crit. The game doesn't want me to win. I mean, that's all I can say at this point. The game doesn't want me to win. Ugh. How you doing, Catlow, brother? I'm dying out here. I'm absolutely dying. These normie teams, as I like to call them, are killing me. Anything that uses Ogre Pond and then like two plus other normal Pokemon, I call a normie team. <laughs> like Urshifu, Fluttermane. Normies, all of them. I mean, what do I even do here? I just lose, right? Like. Like, Terra Ground doesn't help me here. Well, it's, yeah, Dazzling Gleam, obviously. And then he's just gonna one-shot me, right? With, like, Hydro Steam. He's gotta be Scarfed. No, he's not even Scarfed? How did he outspeed Ambipon, then? How fast is Walking Wake? Oh, I live? Well, I mean, I die to my own recoil damage here. How fast is Walking Wake? I didn't even kill. What the fuck? I wouldn't give for a walking wink. How fast is this boy? 109 speed. How fast is Ambipom? I thought Ambipom was like 110 speed. I'm max speed. I'm 115 speed. And I'm max speed. And he got boosted special attack, right? Am I not max speed? Am I... Am I adamant? <laughs> am I adamant? No, I, I, I'm jolly, I thought. Wait a minute, I gotta look, I gotta look. Heck off, Gabe. Heck off. Because that's some shenanigans right there. Because I outspeed 100% of the time if I'm max speed. And Because that guy was not Scarf. And he was not booster speed. Because he got a special attack boost. So he's not even max speed. Ambipom? Ambipom's max speed. How did I lose in speed there? I'm not max speed. Wait, no, this is the wrong Pokemon. I'm max speed! How did I lose in speed against that guy? That doesn't that doesn't make that that doesn't make sense. That does Wait, no. Am I crazy? Wait. Did Amber Palm lose in speed against that guy? I try to think. Or did I lose in speed to the Flutter main and then he died before he could do anything? I'm thinking of the Golduck. No. Hmm. I don't even remember what happened. <laughs> I got crazy. For some reason, I think Ambipom didn't outspeed there. I mean, obviously, Golduck doesn't outspeed. He's got, like, base 80 speed. It doesn't matter if I put max speed on him. He's slow as heck. No, he outsped my Ambipom, didn't he? Yeah, because he killed my Ambipom before Ambipom could attack him. Right? He got hit with the Hydro Steam before he could do an, an attack. But my Ambipom's max speed. But, and he's got more base speed than the guy who didn't have max speed because he was max special attack. Am I going crazy? <laughs> Am I going crazy here? Or, like, something's wrong here, right? Ambipom has more base speed. I am maxed out on speed. Walking Wake, 109 speed, Imapom, 115 speed. 
He was boosted special attack, so he didn't get any speed. There wasn't... There was Tailwind. Oh, there was Tailwind. I thought the Tailwind ended already. No. No, I died too fast for the Tailwind to end. God dang it. Going crazy. I completely forgot because I killed that guy in the first turn that he did have a Tailwind up. Still, because that fight ended so fast, he still had that Tailwind up to like the very last turn, I think. Man. No, not singles. We don't do singles here. I should do a singles one one time. Doubles is just so much better on this, though. I don't... I mean, if I was going to do singles, I'd rather just do Smogan. But I think doubles is superior on this one, but... I don't know. I could do, do like a... I could do like a singles... Like the same challenge with singles, but instead of shiny Pokemon, I could do like raid Pokemon. Which would make it a lot easier for me for getting a new Pokemon, and it would actually really open up a lot of Pokemon, because there's not a lot of Outbreak Pokemon. You'd think there'd be more, but I looked up the list, and it's like not even close to like half the Pokemon you can get in the game. Porygon 2, so that's Eviolite. I mean, this is always a good lead. Like, regardless. I mean, we put Dawn Fan, because Dawn Fan kills. Dawn Fan kills nothing. Actually, besides Urshifu. Because that guy's got Levitate. And that guy's going to die to Malamar first turn every time. I mean. And then who would I bring? Masquerade? Masquerade kind of deals with uh, Ting, Ting Lu. Ting, Ting Lui? I forgot his name. Ting Lu. That's going kind of deals with Bronzong, I guess. I don't know. This is a weird team. I'll bring Golduck. What's Golduck do against this team? Ice Beam? Hydro Pump? Does it not speed nothing? I could do water. I did a water base here. Polytoed Golduck lead? Nah. To, I, I should have thought about it more. I haven't done a Politoed Golduck lead in a really long time. Or Politoed Masquerade lead. I've been throwing out, I mean, I just really love Ambipom plus Malamar lead. Especially when they have like a uh, Intimidate Pokemon, like Incineroar. Malamar just eats that up. But I really need to start thinking, because I think I'm getting too much into like using just these two Pokemon, because I like them too much. I love the monkey. Okay, Ting Lu, Ting Lu Bronzog is scary, but not too scary. What I could do here... I'm gonna fake out you, and I'm just gonna superpower you. <laughs> I'm not even gonna think about it. I don't care. If he protects, whatever. If he... I don't know. He might... What might happen here is he's probably going to shift the dimensions and make all my Pokemon slower than him. If he Terra Ghosts, I'm going to be really pissed. Okay, that's fine. Terra Fairy, okay. Is he going to Terra Blast my Malamar? I'm going to be kind of pissed. Take out, good, he didn't protect. Okay, great, 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 great. Don't you dare! Terra Blast my Malamar. Iron Defense. Fine. That's 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 fine. Do I Terra Steel here? Is the question. I mean, Triple Axel kills you. I think I'm going to Terra Steel Terra Blast Bronzong. I'm kind of scared of this Terra Fairy Bronzong. I'm not going to lie. He just Iron Defense. He might start body pressing me. Oh, God. If he body presses my Malamar now, I'm going to be so sad. I mean, I'm plus one defense, but I think I die to that, right? Bronzong's tanky as heck. Triple Axel kills Ting Lu here. Oh, nice crit. Man, Triple Axel monkey. Who would have thunk it that that'd be like my strongest Pokemon? Maybe he Terrace Fairies Terrablast Malamar here and I, I win. I win the game. Okay, that did not do a lot. And the Iron Defense again. Maybe I shouldn't have Terra Steeled. Leftovers Bronzong. Okay, I'm in a really bad position. What do I do? Melo, 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 Melo,
Mama, mama, mama Sita. Um, do I go into Don Fan here? No. I think I just tank. But I gotta terrorblast this guy now. I'm too scared. I'm just gonna expect both my Pokemon to die this turn. Okay. But well, why? Is that like some fucking 50 IQ play right there? So I don't attack Bronzong with Terra Blast Steel this turn? So I can get another Iron Defense up? Million IQ play? Wow, that did nothing. That's plus one. Yeah. Yeah, that's fair. That's bad for me. And the crit. Wow. I don't think the crit mattered. I think plus four defense body press super effective would probably kill me anyways. The real question is, what the hell do I do now? Uh, do I have a special attacker? <laughs> no, he's not assault vest because he couldn't be. Wow. I do have a special attacker. He's trash. I was not expecting body press to be my one weakness here. Uh, I guess I try to confuse him. Wow, that does nothing. That is a tanky Porygon. I do love Porygon 2 Eviolite. It's like one of my favorite normal Pokemon. And I missed the Hurricane. That's fair. That's fair. Barry? Trick Room. Yeah, I lose. <laughs> There's like nothing I can do here. I just lose. Uh, I lost to Terra Fairy Bronzong, everybody. I need a shirt that says that. I played Pokemon VGC today and all I got was this dumb sh No, I lost to Terra Fairy Bronzong and all I got was this dumb shirt. I'm not even gonna try. I would need like insane luck to beat him at that point and he just one shots my whole team with the rest of his Pokemon. Like there's nothing I can do. I really needed to pile in. I should have even I shouldn't have even worried about that flutter main. I should have Terra steeled, hit that guy with the Terra Blast, hope for a crit. And I should have also hit him with a triple axle too, just for the extra damage. Maybe I could have killed him eventually. But then how do would I even deal with the with that guy at that point? I mean I had to get the kill that turn or else I'd lose anyways. I couldn't deal with Fluttermane with anyone else. I mean, I guess I could have with uh, uh, with normal Tusk, but yeah, he could have survived with Sturdy, but then he would die to the other Pokemon. Eh. Golly, I guess maybe no, because there's no way I knew. There's no way he knew he was going to Terra Fairy the first turn. So he's always going to get that. He was always going to get that first one off. That first Iron Defense. And then after that, I did attack him with Terra Steel Attack. And it did nothing. And he got a second one off. Golly, I think his team just countered mine. I think that Bronzong just countered my team. I could have brought in Golduck with a Hydro Pump. Maybe have done something. Yeah, that Masquerade was a mistake. I should have brought in Golduck or Politoed. Politoed Muddy Water would have been good because he could have just thrown those out and gotten some accuracy drops and maybe won that way. But I was just not expecting that Bronzong. <laughs> I didn't even know that was a set for him. Crazy. Couldn't be found. I'm just too good at this video game. Uh, what can I say? All right. I'm going to do one more fight. Hopefully we can get the new Pokemon. If not... Maybe I'll do another one. Who knows? I kind of want to hit that 60 today. That'd be so cool. They're not even throwing trainers at me anymore. I'm too powerful. Man, they're really... They're just... They're scared. They're just scared. They don't... Want to fight me anymore? And I find that incredibly rude. Like, where? 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 
Where are they at, though? Where are the trainers at? Dude, it's a Friday. Don't go to a club on a Friday. Play Pokemon with me. That's all you gotta do. Play Pokemon VGC on a Friday night. You don't need to go to a club. You don't need to socialize. You don't need to have a love life or friendships. Yeah, just play Pokemon with me. <laughs> uh, Jay Darwin. All right, that's a Tinkaton and a Primarina and a Survivor and a Crocodile. I got his name. Oh, Ambipom lead here is not great except against Survivor. I mean, Fake Out's always good. Malamar here. Meh. Meh. Malamar's meh. I mean, I like the Ambipom Dawn fan, actually. Deals with a lot of things here. Primarina. Um, the Slug, the Tinkaton, the Metagross, the Survivor honestly kind of deals with that too. And the Fire Guy, that's a great lead. Um, Politoed, Golduck in the back. I don't think Malamar is that great here. Yeah, this is fine. I'm a little worried about this Contrary Survivor this, and this Primarina. I'm not too worried about the Tinkaton because I could just, if it's leads, I'm fine with it because I could fake out high horsepower it. If it doesn't lead, I don't know what its base speed is. <laughs> so I might just die. It's Tinkaton's base speed. I don't think people people wouldn't run like Oh, 94. Yeah, I might just die to it. Very high possibility. But I could maybe revenge kill it. So it's fine. Ooh, this is gonna be a game. This is gonna be a game. And it's gonna be a fun one because you guys see that? There was no Urshifu. There is no heckin' mask boy. Okay, yeah, this is terrifying. I don't like this. I don't like this. I don't like this, but what I kind of like is this, and then I kind of like doing this. No. No, 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 that's not the play. The play is this. To guarantee the kill, and then just high horsepower think it done. Right? I think he's going to Terra Stellar on his guy. I think this is the play. Because there's no way Surviper outspeeds me, right? What is Surviper's base speed? It's not Surviper. What's his name? Is it Japanese? I don't... What is his name? Whatever. I don't, I don't know. It's not Surviper. Superior. That was it. What is his base speed? 113. We are slightly faster. Okay, this is the play. I think I I don't know if I needed to do this. I've never calped Ambipom versus uh, Superior before. I'm doing it just in case. And he's got Fake Out on. Okay, that's great hit for me. Great hit. Thank God he didn't do that on the Ambipom. Looking at the damage, I don't think I needed to Terra Fair or Terra Ice. And now I'm kind of scared to stay in because he's probably gonna hit me with a Steel type move. So I'm probably going to swap Ambipom out if I can't do a lot of damage to a different Pokemon here. Ah, oh, he broke my Sturdy too. Unfortunate. Primarina is the worst thing that could have happened to me. What do I do here? What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? do, I do? Fan is going to not like this. Primarina, 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 Primarina. I think I gotta play it a little bit risky here. I'm pretty sure Primarina outspeeds me. And do I live? I don't think I've lived a water boosted hyper voice on Don Fan. I just have to let Don Fan die. Hope Politoed eats this Megaton, like for breakfast. Oh, it's even rain boosted. Maybe that was a mistake. Primarina, Terra Water, I would assume. Oh. Terra Water Tinkaton. Okay. That's a little interesting. Tank that. We die. I'm pretty sure Sparkling Aria is going to kill. Holy crap. Yeah, that did. That's a. Oh, that's like a quad hit move. Okay. That's funky. I like that. I think I'm going to go into Golduck here, though. I think Golduck's the play. 
Golduck Hydro Pump. This Tinkaton is scary. Actually, this Tinkaton is not that scary. I'm just gonna Muddy Water Hydro Pump the Primarina? Terra Blast, I think, does less damage in the rain than Hydro Pump, but it's less risky. Going for it. I want this Primarina dead more than I want the Tinkaton dead. Oh, there we go. I should be like water absorb something. Oh, it was. Oh, no. Oh, I forgot about him. And I missed the hydro pump. Oh, because Storm Drain takes it. Oh, that's so dumb. I forgot about this stupid Pokemon. And he crit the Politoed. Wow. Wow. Storm Drain, really? I thought Storm Drain just, if it got hit, it took it. I didn't know it was like a lightning rod. At least this still hits the Primarina. Uh, accuracy drop? Literally never lucky. Literally never lucky. I think I lose here. I think I definitely lose here. Get Ice Beam Gastronaut. I'm just gonna Terra Blast the Primarina. Man, if I had done this last turn, that would have been nice. Should have just. I should have followed my gut. I didn't know Storm Drain acted like that. I would. I would have followed my gut and killed the Primarina this turn. Yeah, heal your Gastrodon, you freaking nerd. That's like plus three special attack. That's fine. Is it fine? Is it rarely though? I'm fucked. <laughs> I'm so fucked. I lose. I just lose here. I just, I lose here. I lose? I think I just lose. I lose, right? I just lose. I'm gonna fake out. I don't out speed with anything, right? So that guy is gonna kill me for sure if I faked out. But what if I do this? Ambipom could probably take a Sparkling Aria and Polypoot. Who knows? We'll see. Okay, that's unfortunate. I should have faked out the other guy, gotten the free kill. Fuck. Super unfortunate. How would you do that? I don't know. Miss? Me? That kills, I lose. Wow! Okay, um, absolutely fuck that team. Oh my god. Primarina is the worst. Oh, I mean, she's not the worst. I don't like her. Every time I fight Primarina, I lose, so I do not like her, but I think I don't think she's broken or anything. Like the other Pokemon. I just feel like every time I fight her, I lose because I forget what she does. But that Storm Drain Gastron really screwed me over. I I wouldn't have brought water Pokemon if I knew what Storm Drain did, to be fair. Alright, one more, one more. Storm Drain. I didn't think it acted like lightning rod. I didn't think it like stole your water moves. I thought it was just like Water Absorb, where you just get a special attack boost instead of HP. Golly. That's unfortunate. Oh, do we drop? No, we can't drop down to Pokemon anymore, sadly. I was actually kind of hoping for a Pokeball fight. Would have made this last win easier. All right, 8-8. Eight, eight. We can't win on a... We can't leave on a 50-50. Impossible. I'm going to leave on a 100-100, you know? Yeah, that's the same thing. Cellarage. Oh. Oh, Charizard. Oh, what a team. Okay. Hmm. What does Dawn Fan do for me here? Kills Cellarage, but so does a water Pokemon. I mean, Seed Bomb hits my Lodic. And Kind of fine against a lot of these Pokemon. Tanks Charizard. Can speak out Meowscarita. Eh, this is fine. Sick of running the water team in the back because he has a lot of things that are fine with them, but he's probably going to load up on non fire Pokemon, seeing my two and a half water Pokemon. That's a cute Spriga Sprigatito. Okay, this is fine. 
That's a ghost, right? Is that ghost? It's a ghost. Okay. Amapon's probably gonna die here. That's fine. Be bitter blades Malamar. That'll be kind of good for us, because then we just survive with our cool guy, and we probably revenge kill with knockoff. I don't think Sir Lidge has really strong defenses. He might also weakness policy or something, which would be really unfortunate. Or he might Terra and ruin all my plans. Terra Fire. Terra Steel. Yeah, that's interesting. Close combat. That's fine. I mean, this knockoff might still kill with a minus one. Jeez, what do I do here? Uh, and is that like... Scarfed? Shuka Berry, okay. What is Sarah Ledge's space speed? Eighty-five. He's not that fast. I think Golduck outspeeds even without full speed. Unless he's like max speed, Golduck might outspeed. I know Golduck's actually really slow. Do I protect on Golduck? Eighty. Oh, he's the same speed. Probably running max speed there. I think I'm gonna protect and hit it with a superpower. Yeah. He's probably gonna close combat Golduck here. Because it's the weaker target. And he's just trying to get the kill. Bitter Blade was not what I was expecting. Frick. Frick. Oh, I should have just hit it with the Hydro. Life do? Actually, this is fine. This is actually not a bad trade for me. I'm pretty sure I kill here. Like, even Max. I think Superpower will just kill. Yeah, that's 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 fine. That's not great. It's not a great start for me, but it's not the worst. Malamar is outsped by this Milotic, which is interesting. I just realized that. Gourmet, you know, Uh I mean, I definitely die here, right? Yeah, Golduck is just dead. Um, that's fine. I'm going to double up on this Masquerita. One of them's got to get through, right? I think the Milotic... I mean, if the Milotic kills Malamar and the Masquerita kills Golduck, I just lose at that point, so there's no point in thinking about it. I'm just hoping the Milotic can't OTK or Oko Malamar from this... Really? Okay. That's interesting choice. Very interesting choice to kill him instead of Goldie. Nice! I didn't think that would Oko. Okay. We get hit by like a Surf here, Hydro Pump, Golduck can tank. Muddy Water. Unfortunate if this lowers my evade or my accuracy. God damn it. I never get that lucky. All right, Terra Grass. We still have our Terra, which is really good. Terra Grass. We're gonna Terra Grass. We're gonna double up on Scream Tail. So as long as I kill that Dawn Fan Terra Grass, one v ones is my Lodic, I think. All right, Speed Defense. It's not great for me. No, 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 no. I'm gonna Ice Beam Scream Tail, and I'm gonna Terra Grass Seed Bomb. This scream tail. I think that hits harder than horsepower at that point. Oh, we're out speeding. And we hit freeze, 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 freeze. No, never lucky. Isn't freeze like a 30% chance on ice beam? I think. Where's my Terra? Hello? Video game, where's my Terra? You can't keep doing this to me. Why did that keep happening? I swear to God. I, okay, so if I Terra and then choose a move and then I go back from the targeting screen, does it get rid of my Terra? It does! Oh my God, why? Why does it do that? Has it always done that? 
Why does it get rid of my Terra if I go into the targeting screen and go back to change my move? That has that's but that's that's what's been happening. Oh my god, I would have lived that muddy water by like a long shot. Ah, uh, fucking stupid ass game freak mechanics. <laughs> fucking terrible ass game freak UI. God, why did I think this game was like had good UI? I never thought that. That's a lie. This game is fucking awful UI. Like, why is that a thing? It doesn't even like tell you that that's gonna happen. It's not like a big thing. It's like, oh, your Terra disappeared. God damn. That's what's been screwing me over. I thought I just like kept unclicking it before I accidentally hit the move or something. That's so awful. That's so awful. Jesus Christ. I should be able to choose a move, hit the Terra button, choose a move, then go back into the move selection and then not disengage my Terra. If someone really wanted their Terra disengaged from that point, they would just hit B again. It makes no sense to have it be like that. Because if they're specifically trying to get rid of their Terra, they would just go back to the last Pokemon hit or hit B again. And it would have been fine. It's so dumb. It's so bad. Game Freak, come on. That's, that's awful. That's so stupid. That's the worst piece of like, would you call that UI? I, that, I think that falls under like UI. That's so awful. Holy crap. It just makes zero sense from like any, cause I'm still in the Pokemon moves. Like I would think that my Terra would still be selected. Why would you, why, in what situation would you not think your Terra should still be selected there? Like I didn't go back to my next Pokemon. All I went was like out of the move selector. It's not like that happens in like singles because you don't even have a move selector there. So why does it happen in doubles? Ugh. Ugh. Oh my god. All right, one more fight. Win or lose, this is the last fight because honestly, Game Freak has pushed me over the edge today. That's... God, like my brain hurts thinking how just whoever came up with that idea is so bad at their job. <laughs> Who made that? Like, I don't want to make fun of the devs of whoever makes Pokemon because I think Pokemon games could be really good if they were just given the correct amount of dev time. But whoever made this choice just really dropped the ball. Like, I swear to God, this didn't used to happen too. This feels like a new addition because I feel like I would have had this happen to me before multiple times in previous streams. But I think that may have been a brand new change they did recently. Oh my god. Can I get a fight? <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. All right. Ooh, Politoed. Hello, Pol. Oh, Floatzel. Ooh, Matcha Gotcha Kingdra. A Snorlax is a little. I mean, he's going to lead Tornadus and maybe Politoed. I'm just going to lead Ambipom, Malamar. Does Donphan do anything here? Donphan kind of just loses here, right? Donphan does nothing. I'm going to lead... I'm going to have Golduck and Masquerade in the back. Because he's probably going to lead his Politoed, right? What does Donphan do here? Actually, Donphan's good. Terra Grass is really good here. Um, I probably don't need Masquerade. Masquerade... I mean, Masquerade kind of deals with Machu Gacha, but not really. Malmar kind of deals with him a little bit. Ambipom deals with him. So I'm not going to deal with uh, Masquerade, 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 Masquerade. Is that Thunderous? Oh, that's Tornadus, right? Oh, that's Thunderous. That's Thunder Thunderous. That's Thunderous. Oh. Huh. Hmm. Honestly? I wasn't expecting the thunderous. I thought I honestly saw the 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 Jin standing there with his arms crossed. I was like, oh, that's Tornadus. Because who doesn't bring Tornadus? No, that's Thunderous. He's probably running Thunder Thunderous because of Polytoed. I respect it. I respect it. This is a respectable rain team, unlike my team, which is like a fake rain team. Did I not say that's what he was gonna lead? Did I not? 
literally say he's gonna lead Thunderous Polytoad and hit Thunder on Thunderous. What is Thunderous's base speed? 111. I outspeed. Okay. Um. Um, I think I just triple axel here, right? Sorry, I had to deal with something. I, I'm pretty sure I'd speed triple axel kills. I'm just gonna superpower. Unless he Terra Thunder, T Terra Electric here would be brutal. But yeah, that just kills. Triple axel kills Thunder. He's paper thin. I was looking at, his, I was googling his defenses there. His defense is 70. I'm pretty sure that just kills. Yeah. Okay, that's really good for me. That's a huge thing off my back because that thunder is kind of brutal. Superpower. Oh, it's a Tuco. Especially with the boost. Okay, I'm, I'm guessing Muddy Water here. Ether Ball. That kills. That kills Ambi for sure. Yo, Amba Palm. Live at the Weather Ball. That's 100 base and rain, right? That's 100 base water move plus stab. Insane. Ooh, do I do something tricky here? I wonder if Kindra dies to that. Mm. I'm thinking it doesn't even like hurt it, right? Yeah, I don't think even Para Ice, I mean, it's neutral. So I think I'm just going to let him die. I'm just going to superpower this Politoed again. Yeah. I mean, King just Swift Swim's going to outspeed me anyways. Ugh. Is that like Terra Dragon? Terra Steel. Okay. Should have superpowered that guy. That would have been a great play by me. Too bad I'm a coward. Damn it. Too bad I'm a coward. Interesting. I tank it. 81. That barely... If that's a high roll, I live that. Oh, that triple axel actually kind of doing more damage than I thought it would. If I go into Terra Steel, does Steel resist water in this gen? Steel resist water in this gen? I forget. I think it's only in gen like 2. Yeah, no longer resist water. Did it ever resist water? I thought it used to resist water, but no. Looking at Bulbapedia, it never resists water. Um, yeah, might as well just go for this then. Hurricane. Okay. I love that. Oh, there's no way. There's no way I'm that unlucky, right? There's no way. 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 There's no way I'm that unlucky. I'm not gonna hit myself. I'm not gonna hit myself. I've never seen an opponent hit themselves from a confusion from a hurricane, so there's no way I'm gonna do it, right, Malamar? Let's go! Huge, Mally! Huge! Oh my god, that's two Pokemon down, and he's about to wipe me out with like a. Honestly, if he killed both my Pokemon here, we'd be even. Now I'd be up because his Politoed's half damaged. Plus, I still have my Terra, so I'm definitely up in this position, even with a Surfeit. Yeah. Wow, he's running Surfeit instead of Muddy Water. Malamar lives it like a Chad! Oh my god, dude. The Assault Vest Malamar. Showing these fools. Showing these fools what's up. Alright, is it going to be another turn of rain so Goldock can get a speed boost here? Or am I just going to cry myself to sleep? I'm going to cry myself to sleep today. All right, um, hospitality, that's fine. I think I'm just going to double up on that guy. Like, I'm not even worried about Hollytoad. I'm just going to double up on Sinistra. Don't even think I need to. I think plus two knockoff kills, but I don't know if Malamar outspeeds. And if he matcha gotchas me, I'm crying. Yeah, I really need to double up here because Paragrass... Dawn Fan 1v1 Polypoke. Paragrass Dawn Fan does not 1v1 Macha Gacha unless he can use a different move besides Seed Bomb first. Oh, that was so good. Okay, now he does 1v1. Yeah. Oh, he Energy Balls. He doesn't even Macha Gacha. 
An insane person. This guy's an insane person. Oh yeah, I took a, a, a commanding lead here. Polytoad outsped. I thought Malamar was faster. Okay, that's fine. Is it fine? Ice Beam actually is so bad for me. I Why would you run Ice Beam on a Politoed? That's so rude. I should run Ice Beam on mine instead of Icy Wind, I think. So he's gonna water move here, right? I have to kill the Sinister. Do I have to kill the Sinister? What if I just high horsepower here and kill the Politoed? No. What if I gunk shot here? Kill the Politoed? No. I might as well just seed bomb at that point and kill the Politoed. I think, honestly, with the Ice Beam, the Politoed has become a worse thing. Thank God I hit the Terra after I went out every single time there. Now I have to. It's like a, it's ingrained in me. I almost forgot, but I was just like hitting it every time because God damn it. That's such a bad decision on their part to have that happen. All right, Terra Grass, Machigachi, yeah, that should do nothing. That should not burn me. No burn. Hell yeah, no burn. That healed nothing. I don't know if Seed Bomb can out pivot him. Weather Ball should do not a lot. God damn, that did way more than I was hoping. All right, let's see if I can one, okay, that's got a one shot. Yeah. Now the real question is, can I kill this guy with Seed Bomb? I'm thinking maybe I should have gotten Gunk Shot, but I think this will kill. If I don't get burned, I think this will kill, even with the HP gain. If I get burned, I lose. It's all down to this Matcha Gacha, unless he does a different move. Hex! We tank that. Ah! We don't tank a Hex! Oh, that's so unfortunate. We're not even burned or anything. How long is this rain? Is this like Damp Rock? Polytoad? Fuck, we were so close. What could I have done there? What could I have even done there? I don't even know. Honestly. Terra Ice? No. Oh, swap out Polytoad? Oh, uh, ooh. Honestly, what could I have even done there? I have no idea. Gold Duck? I mean, I can't believe... I can't believe... The Politoed outspeeding the Malabar there doesn't make any sense. Because we were outspeeding it like the whole time, right? Does Hospitality boost your speed? There's no way. That doesn't make any sense. It just restores HP. But the we were outspeeding that Politoed the whole time and then suddenly it's outspeeded Malabar? I refuse to believe that. Malamar has like so much speed investment and it's like got higher base speed, I think. 73 versus 70. Actually, if that's max speed, were we speeding it? Were we a speed tie? That would be insane if we were a speed tie the whole time. Would I have done anything different there? Would I have done anything different? I might have protected on Golduck. If I knew Malamar was going to die that turn, I might have protected on Golduck. Went into that guy, and then he would have, like, match a gotcha plus, like, water moved. And then I could have, like, Terra Grassed, Ice Beamed at that point, and then kill that guy, and then he would have Ice Beamed me, and I would have died. No, I think I would have lost. Hmm. Anyway. Anyway, that's going to be the last fight. Sadly, we did not hit 60 today. So sad. Yeah, we lost like four in a row at the end there, mostly to the game. I blame the video game for that. One of those losses 100% would have been won if I terrored correctly. Unlike this game, who apparently hates me so much, it'll un me mid-fight for no reason. Whatever. Whatever. I'm not mad. I'm just disappointed, Game Freak, in your shoddy game. Shoddy, not shitty. Shoddy game. Why would it do that? In what world were like, yeah, this... This is the perfect idea. Have it unterror you if you unselect a move on a Pokemon, but you're still in the move selection screen. Because you really want to unterror during that small frame of you unselecting the move. Yeah, mm -hmm. that's what Pokemon players are thinking. Oh, whatever. I'm 
I'm, 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 I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done for today. I will go sow my discontent elsewhere. It was really fun though. I still had a hell of a lot of fun. Don Fan is amazing. Ah, uh, he is like completely. Uh, man, I'm just like, I still love Trudo Wudo from the bottom of my heart, but Don Fan is just so good. So good. Maybe I should do like a different para, like para electric or something. That would be interesting. Because it would still work on getting rid of Urshifu. And Terra Electric has more interesting things going for it because it would hurt against water. I mean, water, it doesn't, eh, I don't know. I could do something like, I could do Terra Water. But Terra Water, no. I mean, Terra Grass and Terra Water, I don't know. I don't know. Either way, it was fun. It was really fun. And I'm going to, but I'm going to end my stream now. But thank y'all for joining me. No new Pokemon for the next Pokemon stream, probably next Friday. But next Friday, we're definitely going to get a new Pokemon for sure. For sure. For sure. Um, I don't have any plans this weekend for any particular streams. I might play some random games. Might try to play more Elden Ring. Maybe play some Monster Hunter. Play some weird game I found recently. I don't know. I don't know. But I'm going to have fun with it for sure. But I'll see you guys all then. Hope you guys all have a great weekend. Mm -hmm. And I hope you guys all just have a great February. Remember, remember uh, Valentine's Day is coming up. So do not forget your significant other during Valentine's Day. They will beat you up and you'll deserve it. Mm -hmm. All right. Goodbye. Goodbye. Bye.